Guys, make sure you're following us on Spotify and Apple Podcasts. It massively helps us out. Enjoy the episode. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Pitch Side. This week. Woo! Come Bring on. the energy, baby. We're <laughs> back. <laughs> Let's go. This week, we have the angel of the north himself. Oh, very kind. See what I did there? Because... Yep, that's okay, I'm from the good, north. Right? Brian's not going to be happy when he hears that one. He's definitely okay, not the one angel. Of, one he of... calls himself the king. Uh, the king? That's true, yeah, actually, the yeah. king of the north. So I'll, I'll take the John angel. Snow's. That's one step above. That, that's like a theory. Really. But yeah, how you doing, Mo? I'm right? good, I'm good. Thank you very much for having us on. I can't lie, when you said, come on, pitch side, a football podcast, I thought maybe my ball <laughs> knowledge isn't up to, you know, uh, the scratch of a football podcast, but Theo's here. I was going to so say, have you met me? It's true. The thing is, though, my ball knowledge is decent. I just like to... It's not decent. I just, I just say things that we're all thinking that we're too afraid to say. Do you know what? You say things that you're thinking. Mm. <laughs> I think you're Which going down like a, a Goldbridge arc. Huh? Do you know? Do you yeah. remember like a couple yeah. of years ago when everyone thought Goldbridge was a, like an arsehole? Yeah, yeah. And Crazy. now everyone loves him yeah. because of just the daft shit he comes out with. I think you're at the very start <laughs> of the arsehole. You're in your arsehole era. <laughs> in a year's time, they'd be like, this man was a genius the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> everything, everything I've said pre- I don't know if they're getting <laughs> Everything I've said previously, they'd be like, it's all come true. It's all come true, like Salah. What? Gonna what, get do you mean? what do you say about Salah? He's going to win the Ballon d'Or this year. When did you said Lewandowski? We were <laughs> 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 oh, I want him to win, but I think Salah has a shout. It's very true. But before we get started, I'd just like to say a massive thank you to Classic Football Shirts the for goats. supplying us with the shirts in the background. But Ooh. this week's special Ooh. occasion. <laughs> oh. wait, wait, even Will was wearing one. What's going on? So uh, this, if if you haven't seen before, this is the next YM drop. Uh, we have we've kind of we've grown as a brand, and we've just announced uh, YM Athletic Corp. And basically, That's, congrats on your new football club. Yeah. YM Athletic Corp <laughs> is me. unbelievable. That's two people two weeks in a row mm. that now own a football club. <laughs> Te- yeah, cool. two, mate, two. Yeah. So we have signed a deal with two completely fictional South American teams <laughs> to release their 25th anniversary classic football shirts. Uh, so thank you to Pitchside for letting me plug my merch. Please go <laughs> yeah. buy it Thursday, the 28th, 7pm. Wait, have you actually made up and called it a 25-year anniversary? Mate, 1996, 25th anniversary. It's because I like, I, I love that fucking... Sorry, this material. So much. This material. This, oh. The Newcastle, the old stuff, the 90s kit. Yeah, it feels so good. It's not like you don't play football in it, but no. festivals. Festival, mate, this that's what I'm saying. Hat. These shirts, plus a little bucket, a side men bucket. Pitch side bucket hat. A pitch when, side when bucket, so yeah, because oh, we're, 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 we're going to release them soon. But, mate, festivals, they're going to fly off the shelf. A Christmas present. Touch wood, touch wood. And what, what does it all mean, sorry? Atletico so, and my uh, gorda? It's all, basically, I figured after a few years, no one, no self-respecting individual... <laughs> Wants to wear a shirt that says your mother flattered all the way around it. <laughs> so we've disguised it and said, this uh, a Dine Mutter, that is, uh, <laughs> this is a German <laughs> burger company, the sponsors of the shirt. Quality. Uh, that means your mum. This shirt Dine is Mutter. called, uh, I'd let her go make order. Uh, uh, ignore my pronunciation. That means fat mother athletic. <laughs> That one. In Chilean as well, right? In Chilean? It, wait, it'd be Spanish then, wouldn't Spanish it? Spanish and Spanish? Yeah. Is Chilean a language? I don't think Surely it is. Surely they just speak like Portuguese Spanish, or right? Okay, then. <laughs> my ball knowledge out the window again. Uh, that one, uh, I think it's Amante de la Madre. I think that means like a, mother's, lo- a, a mother's love. I'm not sure. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. And that's cute. The that's... team name is Deportivo Cabral, which is sporting arsehole. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Good crack. Club, club de football. Yes, yeah, club de football, yeah, mate. It's legit. It's legit. So they're the two teams that are playing in the Copa de la Madre, then. Yep, the Copa, the Copa of the Mum. Yeah. <laughs> nice. The mum, m- Mother's Cup. Mother's Cup. And, and is, that, is that mine? I, I, yes, replay the other ones. They're yeah, both they've been gifted to us. Because so. that is going to get worn a lot. You think yeah. so? I you love think it. So? I genuinely love it so Yeah, much, when Theo so. likes something, he wears it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> like <laughs> like uh, cows, cows uh, pizza, Crocs. Oh, yeah, I wear, yeah, I wear yeah. it every day. Wear if, it. You're, if you're not playing football, I w- sorry to go on, I would recommend maybe going to size up. If they're a little bit. Mm. If you're playing football, go for a large, but if you're going to wear it, it's yeah, best no, stuff I'd wear yeah. an extra large. But Theo's in an Arsenal kit. We're playing the, tonight. This is, this is my favourite kit of all time. Has it kicked off? Yet? Is it actually? This is my favourite kit. It's, uh, I prefer the, the blue. The blue. The blue away kit. You remember with Do you know like who that faded. reminds me of? Lauren. Oh, Laurent. Laurent. That, no, surely the maroon one with the O2. That's, when that's, Walcott, a, that's still a had hope as well. Yeah, yeah, no, still hope had, and that was when we still had Perez, Burkham, Henri, Sol Campbell, the lot, Jens Lehmann. That was our final year at Highbury. Yeah. I do have that. some nice kits. We've had some, arguably Arsenal is a better kit than team, team than actual team. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, you're like the 100 whoa, Thieves of the man. Premier League. Yeah, you're, a hoodie org, you're a hoodie org <laughs> yeah. of a club. So speaking of which, Will, 
Is yes. that your favourite Newcastle shirt, do you reckon? It's not. There's the Ooh. one. So this is when we were good. That's I think this one. Yeah, Brown we're Ale. Do a Bra- title whenever shot. I see Brown Ale, I was yeah. like, oh, that's prime Newcastle. That. There's prime one Jordy. after yeah. the 97 one's got a nicer collar. Collar, but we were shit then, I think. Okay. I think, I think like Ruth Hullock came in and fucking. Well, you were, one one, of the you were only like, like one year into players. the Copa de la Madre at that point. I made that legendary clash had just gone down. Do you know what my favourite Newcastle shirt is? The I think it's like 04, 05 when you sponsored by Adidas. And Santiago Munez wore it. You know, <laughs> well, he, you know that, but the one that made the kit. The fake one from no, the one, the one in the film. No, obviously. <laughs> oh, was it not the <laughs> NTLP one? I can't remember. I don't know, but I know it was. Oh, three I like. Stripes. Is that the purple? It's like greenish. That, and is it Adidas? Green and purple. purple yeah. I loved that kit. I, can't I loved which that one kit. you're thinking of. Really, it was just an Adidas Newcastle kit. I was like, that is the one. Yeah, really? And Shearer wore it as well. And Gavin Harris. Oh, and, no, Gavin and Gavin Harris. Harris. No, he played for he Real Madrid. Real Madrid yeah. Have, you yeah. seen, have you seen we've got a player called Santiago Munez? I guarantee you've only signed him. Absolutely. Like, has he even has he played for you yet? He hasn't even played for the under-21s yet. <laughs> <laughs> so you literally have signed him for the Instagram? <laughs> for, yeah, for, for literally some Twitter oh, engagement. I, I was reading earlier, apparently, uh, is it uh, Nuno Becker? Or what's the guy that plays? Whoever plays Santiago Munez has just come out and gave Newcastle... Oh, the logo. actor. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah, right, right. Yeah, right. G- gave him a Fulham! <laughs> Go Fulham! <laughs> he gave him a load of um, encouragement for the boys. Did he? For us? Yeah, for you guys. Because obviously you were at the game at the weekend. I was. I will oh, be honest. Bro. I left at half time. No, you didn't. What? <laughs> so... You can uh, hack it. Uh, do you know what it... Well, long story. So we'll start from the start. We'll go there. Took us ages to get fucking tickets, and it was a fucking incredible atmosphere. Like it one took of weeks to felt. get it, I swear. Mate, it took me two weeks. We kind of been weeks because it's takeover. No, no, no. <laughs> no it, was, it, it was took like weeks. ten days. Yeah. Nearly, nearly okay, two yeah, weeks. Fair enough. I'll let you off. Well, I'll let you off. Uh, and I was searching everywhere, and the amount of people on me Instagram were going, "I've got tickets, I've got tickets." Showing <laughs> us a picture, and then be like, ten messages later, being like, "I don't really have tickets, but your videos are good, though." Yeah, yeah thank yeah. you. Oh, and I'm you're getting strong along as well. Yeah. That's the worst. And then I found bad. this dodgy, dodgy Twitter account. I had like twenty followers, full of Saudi propaganda, <laughs> created last week. And I was like, "Fuck it, I'll give him a message." And it was like actually Legit. real. He sent us them, and then. <laughs> So and then we go one nil up. It's brilliant. We've got all the flags out, and then we go one two one down. And then did you see the uh, yeah, the poor yeah, 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 cardiac yeah. arrest? Um, thankfully, Doctor Pritchard now. wasn't it? Yes, the guy that fucking hero, yeah, absolute man. hero. And you, you know my fate in that blood thing. Yeah. So it's definitely. like the whole crowd is going fucking go over here, go over here. Is that actually the reason yeah. why he had to leave? Kind of, not really. I could have. It, it was probably it, like a catalyst as well, wasn't it? Yeah. So yeah. and the new owner's face is so scary. I don't. She looks awful. She does do it better. I don't know what's tap- going on with but it. But in Amanda, we trust. And then everyone around us is going, cardiac arrest, heart, uh, like, heart attack, heart attack. And I'm like, oh shit, I'll go to the loo and just kind of step back for a minute, yeah. compose myself. And I was like in the middle of the row. And I went to the loo and everyone was just like, pulled this. Like, oh, what do you think of that? I was like, oh shit, I've just, oh, I was like, okay. felt one coming on. Oh, I've got to yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. Gotta go. But at least it got worse. And I made it home for the second <laughs> half. Yeah, Kane, good decision, Kane yeah. and Son decided to show up. Yeah. First time this season. Well, Kane's oh, playing for his shirt in at Newcastle, man. That's why he's. <laughs> <laughs> he's got so so well. you, you, yeah. you take it, wouldn't you? You take it. Absolutely. What? You do, you mean, of I'll course. Harry Kane. One of well, the best strikers in the world. He's looking, he's looking a bit washed at the moment. Ooh. If Callum Wilson gets injured, we've got Dwight Gale, man. Oh. <laughs> he's still putting around. That's Dwight Gale. Insane. He's unreal in the championship, but fucking useless anywhere else. Yeah, yeah. that's where every time he goes up. Yeah, and you got Joe Willock. I would do. So who 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 would who would be your top? Three or five at Newcastle, like real realistic. Right now, or right who now. would I sign? Wait, uh, as in top three or five that, that you would want. maintain in to keep in the squad. Sign in January. Th- oh, yeah. oh, as January. in first signing. Yeah, let's just say you were <sighs> yeah. the manager of Newcastle because you, you get appointed over Steve Bruce, who obviously hasn't got much longer. <laughs> uh, and they're like William yeah. Lenny. I you think, now because you did put something in the chat earlier, the screenshot of the. Guy. Oh right. Yes, I would not have him. So no, Jay Ling's really. So Jesse Lingard, I right? Was perfect. Would improve us as a squad, but once dabbed at the Gallagher. <laughs> I've seen that man <laughs> dab at the Gallagher, and I want him nowhere near my club. <laughs> nowhere near. He would. He would make us way better. He would absolutely walk yeah. into my first team. He can get so far to fuck. I'm not arsed. <laughs> he's actually. He's actually a really good character. <clears throat> <laughs> he's oh actually, no. He's actually a really good. Yeah, scary. He's actually a really good counter-attacking footballer. Like yeah. Jesse Lingard Which plays a very good footballer in no, general. No, no, but I mean, he, he works better when he has space yeah. to run in and behind. He, he when you, when you stop. Willett, yeah, and in and a low block. And if you, yeah, exactly. And if you're if he's oh. at Newcastle, he's that's deadly. Like that is pace on the counter. So I would say I don't know if you've seen us our midfield. It's dire. We like. Awful, awful. No, mate, it's John Joe Shelby. Yeah. He's got a good goal. Did you see it? Did you <laughs> win the. Oh, God. 
Did you see his like touches? Well, there was no touches, and it was just silly little fouls. And then I don't. I'm, I'm, I'm so baffled by John Joe Shelby. You know, it was seven minutes. Seven minutes. Minute he came on like 75, 70 did you, minutes. Did you, did you see it? No. So John Joe Shelby got subbed on. This guy runs a football podcast. Uh, it's crazy, isn't it? Hey, I'm John Joe Shelby. John Joe Shelby. John Joe Shelby got subbed on, and then seven minutes later got sent off. What a legend! Just kicking people. That's the most John Joe Shelby thing I've ever heard. Yeah. He is, he is like I swear, John Joe Shelby is like such a weird one, isn't he? Like because he is actually quite good. Yeah, but, but like no he's also legs. such a like a so hit and miss. Yeah, yeah. so hit and miss. He is the Sunderland Lee Catmull equivalent. Really. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, you've got one of each. Literally in the right. derby. So to sign, uh, I, I, I think. Keeping it semi-realistic. Semi-realistic. All we right, we'll, we'll, we've got time, so we will do semi-realistic, right. and then we'll do players yeah. that you just think. All right. So I think first person we need new centre mid, semi-realistic maybe Van der Beek, just anyone Ooh, with an ounce one, of technical get ability. Get one loan. Just, yeah. Yeah. In no, either. Just, either. Just either. Or just, just buy it. Yeah. Well, you know, <laughs> yeah, got the millions. Got, yeah. I, think I keep forgetting you're in the Newcastle yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> then like out there, out there, like a James Ward Prowse. Uh, that's that's who I would go for. That's exactly who I'd go for. I think would any would 100% go as well. Solid. Do you think? Solid. Yeah. How much do you Why? think? Like 60 mil? Be, yeah. Sorry, and and that's South, English. In. Saying that though, that's obscene. Isn't Southampton would take it. Not now, you know. Yeah. You can't not. Yeah. It's, it's, it's not so much how much he's worth to anyone else, it's just how much he's worth to Southampton. Yeah. It's like the rice thing, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. like, yeah. you're not going to sell him if it's going to make you that yeah. much Do you need worse. any more strikers? Is Callum Wilson the one? We do, but I don't know who. Did you see a card he's been linked? But that's exactly what we don't need. Mm. Like, if we can just kind of be like a Leicester or a, or an Everton for just a couple of years, yeah. instead of trying to be like, let's get Coutinho, let's whack him on yeah. 300 grand a week, yeah. but he doesn't care and he'll spend half of it yeah. injured. Let's just get like, I don't know, yeah, your 50, like Tarkowski would be brilliant. And he like Dwight McNeil. Yeah. Tarkowski as well would go down a hit with the fans. Yeah. Yeah. He seems like that kind of guy that the yeah. fans would like. I feel like Newcastle need to sign players that will get on with like the I feel like it's such like a fan based club. Yeah. We need players that really connect with if the fans. Yeah. Like yeah. James Ward Prowse, Tarkovsky, Premier League veterans that obviously have played in the league for a long, long while. Yeah, they know what they're and, doing, don't they? And commit to wherever mm. they go, which is a great, you know, where, prospect going forward. Where do you think we'll finish this season? I Wait, hope 18th now? because that will be absolutely <laughs> oh, hilarious. No, I, <laughs> it'll be the most Newcastle United thing ever. Yeah. I would find it quite sad if you got relegated. Yeah. But it, I would. Cause I, I find it sad when they got relegated the last time because they're too big of a club to go be in the championship. Yeah, yeah they really are. Well, now they're the, the, the well, the richest club in world football, pretty much. I think you'll finish like, like a 15th. Mm. Yeah. Uh, do you know what I would do? Yeah. I had this conversation with someone yesterday uh, and I would go, Big Sam. Come here, mate. He oh, is a we'll fan. Give, hate him. No, no, we'll, fans g- hate him. we'll Bro, give he you. He was we'll awful for us, and then he managed Sunderland and yeah. said we're down. He can't. But you just go, all right, Big Sam. I'll give you ten million pounds oh. to keep to keep us up, and then you're gone. And he and he would do that because that guy is a whore for money. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> and he's also a merchant at keeping uh, teams in the Prem. That's yeah. what I mean. He's the perfect match. Did he not? He went down with West Brom though. He's broke the. Yeah, he's broke oh the yeah, the barrier. You know what I mean, what about Tony really Pulis? West Brom didn't offer enough. We're the richest club in the, maybe the richest club in the world. We can't fucking have Tony. Who do you go for now? As I don't manager. care as long as I, this is a bit out there. I don't think we're in a relegation fight. I think we've just got Steve Bruce. Yeah, no, I would Rafa agree with that. Bene- Rafa be, yeah. finished tenth with a worse squad than we've got now. Yeah. We had fucking Hosselu up front the whole season. <laughs> we spent 150 mil. Callum Wilson, fucking Alan St. Maximin, Rafa was 10th, 13th, and suddenly we're just, it, we're just got a fucking idiot of a manager. Stevie Bruce. Bruce. Oh, sorry. Stevie Bruce. That's it. That's all I wanted <laughs> to say. Right. Ironically, he would be the ideal appointment at this point. Who? Steve? Rafa. Oh, oh yeah, if Rafa he, would if be. If Rafa came back, oh you would be, God, it would, just it would be, be fairy tale. That actually would complete the yeah, it would full be. circle. And you, knew, and you know he'd keep it up. Uh, no, I agree. Yeah, oh, of course, of course. Yeah, Look I at think what he's doing with Everton at the moment. Oh, fl- and their squad's really like... Well, especially with like yeah. how cheap the players they were. That yeah, the, the players that Everton signed are like... There was 1.5 million for both Demaria Gray and Townsend. Yep. Bang, yeah. And they're two of their standout players this season. Absolutely. I just brought Demaria Gray into my team. And we'll just not talk about Rondon. <laughs> we'll just forget <laughs> yeah. about him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 just forget. But you brought Gray in? I did, yeah. Do you not think he's at the end of a good run? Well, it was a toss-up between Gray and Townsend. And I panicked and went for Gray. Just a bit sexier, but just a bit like I just think, more yeah, attractive I, football. I feel, like Town, I feel like Townsend, you know, he's got his two worldies for the season or whatever he gets yeah. every year. Surely the, the odds are that not another one's going to And I feel come, like right? he's going, surely Townsend's run is coming dry, but with Damari Gray, he's going on the rise. Is it not Takure? That's, that's what I, 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 I despise, more despise, the, despise, the, despise the fact that he bought into Takure and he smashes it, so I don't want him. <laughs> but the, you can't play on emotion. I, I, just, obviously, I play on emotion. No, you just have to pick players 
that do well. That's how you know that people know. Yeah, ball. and I clearly know what I'm doing because I'm currently third in the league. What's the current points difference between you two now? Are you top or second? I'm first, I think. Oh, oh, yeah. oh okay, <laughs> okay. I can tell you if you really, 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 really. Well, want. I know I'm first at this point. Yeah. It's just uh, Reverend, oh, uh, oh, he's only first by three points. Mm-hmm. Surely your decline starts now. Surely it averages out and you it, get down Theo's. to sixth. Oh, it oh, started, Theo's, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Theo's, absolutely. It, it started last week. <laughs> yeah. Wait, it started this week, but somehow I'm still in it. Do you know he's adamant to not play his wild card? And they, if, we, this, get two, this, we get two. That's what I mean. This this emotional like stand off. I don't even know what you're I doing. Like you're, like, you're like barricading yourself, being like, I'm not going to play my wild card. <laughs> I feel like and then I'm week now- on week, it's just getting worse. <laughs> <laughs> now that obviously just everyone's, just everyone's played their wild card, now I feel like I'm superior. You've got it in hand, yeah. Yeah, I'm but like, that's not how it works because you're still catching up even when you play it. Wait until the double game weeks, mate. <sighs> that's more of a free Do you hit. Know that's a they are? Do you know when they are? Do you know when they are? And they're in no. January after you've already <laughs> you've spent this one. There's going to be no double game week, surely, this side of Christmas. I'm doing wild carding next week. Are you? Are you? Yeah, I'm debating it. So he bringing in? I haven't given it a moment's thought. If I'm being honest, <laughs> that that's definitely a lie. No, I, I swear to God, I've been too busy. I'm I don't even... think that's a lie. Yeah, Look no, at I, him. I don't get. I don't do it. <laughs> Look at him. That's not yeah, a lie. no, I've got to do my transfers on Wednesday before I go away. Cause oh, because sca- you are going away. Yeah, yeah, I'm scared that this won't work in Dubai. Hmm. It might not. FBI why would not, the Why would Dubai? In, I'm going to Dubai. Why Ooh, would the yeah. internet w- not work in a different country? Uh, like um, <laughs> what's, uh, ExpressVPN, that sort of stuff. Huh? Like, you know you can't watch BT Sport. Bro, have you board. ever checked? And they're not going to block the FPL up. You never know. Have you have you ever checked? <laughs> the, <laughs> bro, it's not haram. You never know. Have you ever it's checked FPL. the overall? Have you ever have you never checked the overall world league table? Every single person like the top fifty is from the uh, United Arab Emirates, mate. I think you'll be fine. Well, maybe I'll hit them <laughs> they up. They love it over there. I'll man. hit them up and be like, lads, FPL meet up in Dubai. Let's yeah. do it. They would. And then get a, get some tips on it. Yeah. Where are you? Huh? Where are you, Will? Uh, uh, no, oh, we, no, you know what? Flying. We can't even flying. He's yeah, flying. We can't we even ch- chat about this because William Lenny has had the absolute goat of a game week, ladies it's and gentlemen. Right, where like, are, have you checked where you are in like I'm the eight, world? I think I'm 850k overall. No, but have you, you've no, seen no, your for, uh, the, for the week. You can do a weekly rank because you must be so high in terms yeah. of the week itself. Come yeah, I think quite, you can only do that on. It's been desktop, quite a lot. Like, it's only been oh, really? Salah and De Bruyne, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. And then everyone else has been stinking. And by the way, how convenient is it? Last week we talked about Salah being one of the could be the best player in the world right now, and then he just proves it. And he just proves it. Yeah. Well, <laughs> he's been doing that all season. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's, but a, like, it's not like you like. No, we sort of spoke it into existence. Yeah. I'm not like, like Mystic Meg here. I think like, we are. Right. I think we are. We're yeah. like Salah's the you, best. So he player. scored that worldie against City, and then you went we're, best player in the but world. But I think I think that <laughs> I think that worldie, and then this week's worldie yeah. have just confirmed like you actually cannot stop whatever he yeah. tries to do. Yeah, because like, well, they, the they dived people, in on his right yeah. foot, right, and then yeah. fuck it. That was the hilarious thing because the Cathcart goes sliding in uh, for the tackle that Salah. The does the week league. before yeah. yeah literally identical like for like and then he just cuts it back and scores anyway outrageous <laughs> outrageous yeah poor Danny Rose mate oh, he's mate. been on the fish and chips like <laughs> <laughs> that man oh, that man has he's been through a lot he's though, finished, bro. He, don't yeah. give, he don't give a fuck about Watford mate he, he's already said he's already come <laughs> out and, he's already come out and said multiple times like yeah I, I'm I, not I, asked I, I don't care yeah but you, you understand you, you can like bear in mind what he's gone through you can understand why he probably doesn't care yeah what has he, what's he gone through he went through like severe depression sorry Okay. It's okay. Sorry, sorry. sorry. But no, like he's still pl- he's still yeah. playing. You know what I mean? Know. He's still flying. Yeah, he's, still, he's still he's still starting in a Premier League. Yeah, yeah. fair enough. You got that's enough. that's that's testament to how good of a footballer he actually is. It's because it, it, even yeah. out of fitness and slightly lacking in match minutes, he's still capable of starting. Who was that in the Spurs prim? left back? Like Asuakoto. He, he didn't. He didn't like. He football. He came out God. so many times saying, "I hate football." Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, <laughs> I, I, and I do it for the money. Because it was David. David Bentley. Yep, yep. Yeah. Yeah. That. That's why we sacked him, off at, yeah. sacked him off from Arsenal. Maybe there's something in that club, man. There's something at that club. It's going out of dodgy, dodgy Spurs. Kane looks like he don't want to be there. What about Son though? Yeah, he loves it, mate. Do you reckon he's going to be a Spurs legend? Oh, big time. If he did. Oh, or, or he gets picked up by somebody else. I don't 26, 26, 27. Yeah, he's prime. Is he still in his prime? But he's like he's like Jesus over in Korea, man. Oh yes, <laughs> oh yes. Honestly, that yeah, no, he legit. Yeah, he's royalty, isn't he? Really royalty. Well, basically, I think I can see him going to like um, not maybe not a Barcelona, but I can definitely see him going to like a Real Madrid in the next couple of years. Like, I think he's being wasted. Like a, at, yeah. I think he's being wasted over at Spurs. It's surprising he, he was Liverpool sort of making those noises that Kane like, was making never, in you, the summer. Yeah, right? you never see like transfer rumors about Son. No. Like mm-hmm. why? Like he's one of the best players in the Prem by far. 
And how long was that deal? Like five, six years? He's just signed four, five, he just six signed oh, a yeah, new deal. New, yeah, yeah. Signed a new deal oh. at the start of the season. You go, why? Yeah. Oh, what? son. Why has he done that? Probably gets a lot more money now, I suppose. Well, I suppose if Kane leaves, Son will become like the number one but he w- guy. Yeah, he w- even when Kane, you know, remember those first two uh, and weeks he stepped of the season? Up. Yeah, and he was like the, the talisman of the team already. Just so happens that both Harry Kane and him are like interchangeable, really, aren't they? So you named your, you named your realistic targets for Newcastle. Yep. Who's your summer signings? Because I, I, so I call the January is oh, the realistic yeah. one, and the summer are the, the Mbappes. So Tarkovsky and James will prowse in January. Yeah. And, then, and then what? I, you and can't, then I can't actually physically fucking process the thought of going, you know what? We will go out and fucking... It must be a great feeling. Like, we can't do that. We can't... Well, we could if our... Yeah, you do that. You do no, that. No, you, you get linked you, with... You, yeah, you... You've you got you, Pepe. We're the yeah, seventh world-class Pepe. We, we have to think of realistic players that we can get. Same you here. have no limitations now. Do you, In two uh, you know what? Time, you know what? I think they do. I think they do. No, no, no. It, they don't have Champions League. No. Mm. They are a bit shite. Cold. <laughs> yeah, at, at this, well, at this point Who's in time, go- but I mean, I mean, in a few seasons' time, they they can look at anyone and be like, "I want him." I feel like you need one player to just trust you. Yeah, and, that and just is, send and it. And that is bring the him. snowball started. Yeah. Who the, who who's player? the one player? Who's got who's got the biggest contact list? It's got to be Coutinho. It's got to be Coutinho. Fuck Coutinho! It I don't is. want <laughs> Coutinho. <laughs> it I don't even want Coutinho in January. It is Lewandowski. Why? He's always cro- oh, Lewandowski. How old is he now? Thirty-two. Yeah, he's unreal. But black and white. Probably, probably wouldn't go. He's, uh, he's Bayern Munich who, though, who would you here. say like superstar who like, superstar. Well, I you know go, what I, I would love Pogba I would, I would Pogba get, is probably my favourite non Newcastle Prem player it's not going to happen I would I would start to look towards Neymar. building to the future so like Damsgaard yep Ooh. Uh, wonderful. Wonderful. Mahler both, De- both Danish actually both, Danish. both you're very just, good you're just listening off Euro fantasy yeah, points, yeah. <laughs> no no, <laughs> this no. Is just, the point merchant this is the new equivalent of FIFA knowledge no <laughs> No, there's Le plenty. Croix. I mean, uh, uh, Marshall, I'd pick up. Would do. I think do you know what the problem with Marshall is? I've told Josh he's been shit for about two years. Because well, he has. Wait, so, yeah. so you... But I've been so, on Josh about him being shit. So Newcastle won't sign Anthony Marshall no, no, because no, no, you no, speak to I'm going to be conflicted. I'm going to be... <laughs> okay, so I can't, right. That's not my ideal. That's not my really dream. Good, he'd look really good in black gloves in a black and white oh, kit. It would work. On a Tuesday night at Stoke. Griezmann, Griezmann loves Newcastle. He always plays as well on football. Does manager. he really? Yeah. Oh, you know what? That's because he's just—is he on loan at Atletico? Atletico at the moment. He's, he's gone back on loan. I think. Is it a two? Or is it? A, did he sign? I can't remember. I reckon you swoop on in on loan. For, Option to buy. I reckon I mean, you swoop in for like Kessie ahead of United yeah. when they go for him in the summer. Such a, mate, I think Griezmann's the one. The, the one to do it all. The one to start off a snowball. Fun. And he loves playing in stripes. We know that. And would he want? Mm-hmm. And he would he would he want to come to the prem and be like, look, I can come to the prem and, prem and do it. Messi, you're clearly inferior to me because I can do it in the Premier League. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about now? Ronaldo isn't doing it in the Premier League. What's, yeah, what's your argument now? But he is. He just completely he still stank is. out that team. Did you watch the game? He's Last, ruined that team. Oh, I'm sorry. Like he's not doing every single game. He's still done it more than Messi. This he scored two goals against Newcastle United, and that's about it. He, he also bagged a hat trick for Portugal. I, two, two, two of them were penalties. penalties. Two were pens. He almost scored one of the greatest goals, bicycle kicks ever. Didn't. Yeah, yeah, arguably he didn't, yes. I'd just like to point this out. Tino Livramento, mm. the fullback for Southampton. Up to 4.3 Chelsea, million now. Yeah, exactly. Chelsea youth player has got more FPL points in the last five weeks than Cristiano Ronaldo. Ooh. Cool beans. So is Salah. Well, what? <laughs> so is Trent, probably. Yeah, but I'm saying he's a, he's a Southampton... Right back. He's 4.3 mil. The other one's yeah. 12.6, fella. Maybe it's time to go. <laughs> Maybe I say goodbye <laughs> to my If you sacked him, I've sacked him. Yeah, but I've sacked him for another donkey. Neither of them are scoring, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Romelu's not scoring. Well, it's obviously Liverpool United next week, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So it's like, I think United win that. Do you reckon? Oli under Trafford, pressure is a different animal. And, I, I know and what? Salah always gets clamped against Ronaldo will United. bag a hat-trick as well after Literally, this. Literally, big game, <laughs> Literally. big game. Big game and Ollie needs save. No. See, that's what I'm talking about. I don't think so. Do you I know don't know. I no. can see it's it. Just written, it. It's, it's written, mate. It's written. It shouldn't be, times. but I think it's written. I, I, I would back heavily against that. I don't think it's going to happen. See, I, I know, like, Ronaldo... I think it'll be high scoring, but I think Liverpool take D. take it. Yeah, yeah. Do you reckon it's time for Jota to go, by the way? I'm sort of just asking you on tips for my team. What, by the way. he's still in your side? Yeah. He's got to go. He has to go. He has to go. He has to did go, the Firmino hat trick not help confirm whether or not? That <laughs> did make me think, like, oh, fuck. But you can never bring Firmino in either. Can <laughs> no, you? You, you, can't, can't, you, can't, you can't. It's impossible to bring him in. Yeah. No. That's why anyone that had him, you know, like the top scoring players of the week, I was like, you actually know nothing about yeah. <laughs> what he's yeah. doing. Well, I bought him in last year, Firmino, mm. and he bagged a couple of weeks. Did he, though? I remember, you, I remember, you remember, I remember that? that point, and you were like, 
done it again. Big <laughs> bombing. <laughs> Sitting at the bottom of the yeah, table. Yeah, yeah. Like four points off bottom. We're like... <laughs> I know Genius. we talked about it before the final day, but you actually got caught up in that scrap, didn't you? I did, I did. I was, what, four points? You were clear of that big fraud. <laughs> that big, well, little fraud, little fraud. Little, little fraud. fraud. <laughs> Tiny little what fraud. a day that was. It was good, it was good. You needed it, though. The stars aligned for you, right? The gods looked down up here yeah, on me absolutely. on that day. It, it, was good t- it was good fun. But this year, not going not gonna to happen because I'm not going to put myself in that position. You are, you are going straight back down there. Let's not hit the <laughs> no, Like, you had a great start, a brilliant start, but it's not... Chris had a good start last I'm time and he lost. I'm still second. He, still, he paid for Hawksmoor. Right, you you will. If you're above fourth, I'll be amazed. We've only got to battle Joel this time. Yeah, Joel's finished. No, right? not yeah. even that. Joel, Joel's, Joel's you, gone. We don't have to battle Joel because he's not doing any battling. Well, there you go. He, there's, there's Joel is one of them. Jmx for people. Have you explained the forfeit? Do they um, know? Wait, I don't. I don't even know the forfeit myself. So the forfeit is, is if you're in the bottom two or maybe the bottom one, you have to drive everybody else in a minivan to Cornwall. Yeah, I think that's pretty much locked in. Joel won't do that. No, yeah. but the thing is, though, I you would, would love that. Yeah, even if I got bottom two, I still dream. volunteer to drive because yeah. I don't want to get car sick. <laughs> so I just drive and drive. But it has to be a good van. <laughs> Do we all have to go in the same van? Can we not I'd love that. I'd actually love that. Oh, yeah. I think Surely it'd be we incredible. Have, we have We're to playing like chess in the back. It'd be great. I'm joking. <laughs> sounds mental, like so. <laughs> I don't think Chippo's going to be playing chess in the back of a blacked-out Sprinter van. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> Black Town Sprinter van. Well, and no, I would if we if I'm doing the driving, <laughs> I want to do a I want a nice. You're taking us away on a robbery, man. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? Well, you're paying for it if you're in the bottom two. No, I'm not going to pay for it, but I'll happily drive a nice brand new Mercedes Sprinter van for everyone. Yeah, so we have a YouTube mini league. We've mentioned it before, <laughs> and there's a forfeit in fantasy football for the bottom two. But they also, we just keep saying bottom two, and nobody knows what bottom two. But they also is. have to pay for the entire trip to Cornwall, right? Yeah, that's I think true. So Everything. I think it's Airbnb. Surely not drinks. I think that's taking yeah. the piss. I think Airbnb and travel. Yeah. Airbnb and travel? Yeah. No expenses while we're out there. Maybe I, one I dinner. I didn't read the There'll be a meal there as well. There'll we be a meal. meal. Because yeah. I feel like they got off lightly last Are year. Are we arranging it here and now? <laughs> Is that what we're it's doing? usually whatever Cal Freezy says comes <laughs> yeah, through. Yeah, literally. Right, whatever. Cal yeah, Freezy the God. Yeah. Whatever he says we do. I'm looking forward to it though. Nice, that would be fun. Nice little trip. To... It'll be good. Yeah, it'll be yeah. good. What are we going to do it in June, July? Yeah. Yeah. After the what do you think of surfing though? What do you... I know what you're, you're shite at it. Have you ever tried it? I never I tried it. No, Mate, I did not. it. I tried Which it. Which is weird because you're from Seaford. So you'd think. No, that I'm you... not. I've, what do you I, mean? I've you're... developed a little bit, but I'm not great. Mm. I tried it again a couple a year and a half ago in Cornwall. Right. Oh my God, lads. It, you know Hawaii? Mm. L- it was lovely. Yeah. Not like Cornwall. a bath. Not Cornwall. It's really? wave after wave after wave, just smashing you in the face. You're like, but you that's know, how you learn. You just can't breathe. That's it's just salt. You, you just sit, you're standing there like crying. You're like, get me out of this fucking sea, and it's just freezing. <laughs> you're just it's not, it's not coming down your nose. I was like, I'm just trying to get out to the waves so I can just attempt to stand up. And every seat. time I every time I attempt to stand up, I just fall straight off. And then and then it's just the relentless oh, punching in the face from the oh, waves. Oh, that's good. That's, I'd like to see that. Get me on a fucking wakeboard. And we're See, fine. that's awful. People pretend that wakeboarding's a fucking shit sport. No, it's lovely. Yeah. I hate wakeboarding with every fibre yeah. of me being. You don't like it either? You try no, it? no, I like it. I like. I'm, I was agreeing with you. Not oh, oh, I hate I'd Honestly, I'd rather put me fucking head in boiling water. But like, like just but <laughs> how, how, off, good, how good did you feel <laughs> when you finally stood up in bro, Hawaii? I ne- oh, in, so wakeboarding, shite, wake surfing's good because I can do it. Wakeboarding, yeah. fuck me, I hate that. Because there's that what so I don't know if you've seen the videos on Twitter of everyone goes and like round the docks yeah. and it's just like you're up down up down up and then they're shouting you just just stay do on your this feet, mate. So, yeah. you know what I'm like I can't take instructions yeah, yeah. and it's just like oh, I'm I was, underwater I, it's freezing I was there day one skiing mate oh, but that was that was oh, I mean I was pretty bad as well to be fair in terms of like Meg telling me what to do and I'm just being like please Stroppy bugger. leave me alone yeah that's all right we we'll, we'll all learn wakeboarding was lovely I I enjoyed it I enjoyed it it was during the summer it was like peak covid lockdown they were allowed to open for some reason really? well, it's outdoor sport, sport, wasn't it? Yeah. it was beautiful i miss it and now we're stuck in fucking october winter and all the came around quick that didn't it Make suddenly it just run out of anywhere yeah halloween Depression. halloween oh, halloween is yeah. here christmas decorations are oxford street i'm looking forward great to football it. chat sorry yeah have you seen <laughs> the, <laughs> have you seen i'm the, looking the, forward to it yeah have you, have you seen this the mariah carey spike it started oh it's what started the little upward trend yeah yeah the first there's one every year that it 
jumps and then it comes down again and then it comes up for the big one at Christmas and it's hit the first. It's Mariah and Michael Bublé both every year yeah, they just true. look at their bank account. He's still like, living in it. It rises. Have you seen him? On t- he's on TikTok now as well. Oh God. And he loves the fact that he is like Mr. Christmas as well. Uh, it gives me a little bit like, you know, Ollie Murr's dick in a Pringles can energy. <laughs> it just gives me like, I see them as very similar people, <laughs> just like middle-aged creeps. Ollie Murr's has played soccer aid, mate. Um, Ollie, Ollie Murr's is a gimp. <laughs> 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 speaking of uh, soccer raid I don't yeah, know that's why I tried to do that speaking that's, of soccer yeah, raid yeah. can you say that word oh yeah yeah just just I mean gimp what? suit you know rubber latex suit yeah, yeah, he's not he, actually he, a gimp no, he, okay. no he's into that <laughs> okay, that's what you were saying alright good okay. um, yeah anyway speaking of soccer raid clash of creators yes, you're down I know how are you preparing for I'm it I'm not preparing it's in February you're not preparing nobody's Whoa. preparing yeah. preparation prepare- started no, no more I'm drinking running. I'm running but just because I got a little bit fat Right, I'm, I'm not running for that. Yeah. Will five a side prepare me? Oh yes, that? massively, yes. massively, and it, even yeah. positionally. Mate, do you think I can it, brave centre back? Five a side will yeah. make your touch immaculate. Oh, bro, it'd be, it, it will. Be so easy to yeah. play in and clash fitness. when you realise that there are no walls around the pitch. Yeah, yeah. I need to come back to five a side. I, I mean, I'm ignoring the chat yeah. for a little while. I'm a little bit injured, but I'm, I'm coming back. Yeah. And when I come back, whoo-hoo. and do we think there's any hope of a side men charity much? Because if I, I would be lying, I yeah. would be lying if I yeah. said I maybe haven't lined clash up just in case there is a side yeah. mentality. If anything, it, if anything, it would be in the summer. Yeah? yeah. I think. Surely. Come I on. Think. Yeah, come, come on, on, boys. Come on, get it out. I think. There, there, there yeah. will be one. There will be one. They, they're all gagging to yeah. play football again. Well, what do you mean? They are. Yeah, I know, but... There's a, there's they're gagging, gagging to play a charity ready match. for some... It's gone charity gold. balls, big charity balls. Where are, you, are you supposed to <clears throat> doing it this year? Yep. Yeah. Well, I was yep. last time. Yeah? Yeah. Wasn't I? Yeah. I think centre back, art, art. centre back, and then you just shouting at everybody. Up Shout everyone. Yeah. Piss off everyone. Yeah. Get on the rest back. Give score, me the ball. Score a couple of goals. Have a fight get, with Spencer. Get injured for the next three get weeks. Get injured for the next three weeks, and yeah. we're job done. No. <laughs> <laughs> this year, I'm going to make sure I don't. I'm not in Ibiza a day before. The, Were you? We got back the night before. Interesting. I swear there was quarantine logs at that point. Not if you're double vaccined. Uh, vaccine. Yeah, <laughs> double vaccine. There you go. See. Yeah, check your facts on that sorry, one. Man. Sorry, man. Sorry, I'll take it back. But like, we had we had fucking Joel. Thank you. <laughs> what, I, don't, I, don't, yeah, I don't even know what you said. If I'm being honest, so check your facts. Oh. You said check your facts. Keep good. Just oh. keep good. Yeah, we had Joel who was drunk. Right. We had multiple people who had returned from a. And big Harry, family. who wasn't double vaxxed and. No, Harry didn't come from nowhere. <laughs> Harry wasn't, Harry, Harry Harry wasn't, wasn't there. Even there. I don't know what you're sorry. talking about. What was Clash of Creators? I don't even remember that day. Never heard. But have you been told what team you're on? No, oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. Do you want to stay that. in the same? Um, yeah, I, I think I, I would like to play in the team because I never actually got to play in the team I wanna, that I was supposed to. Wasn't I want to play on Spencer's team. I right, got, well, all right. Because well, he'll win. <laughs> I've got to say, that it was fucking quality, mine, last time. Unreal. I was like, a lot of people, I can't lie. Did you there go was a lot of people in that group chat. No, I just I okay. hung over it. But uh, <laughs> there's a lot of people, I swear, that kind of signed up for it as a bit of a joke. Oh, 100%. And they were like, oh, this is obviously going to be a shit show. Let's, you know, get stuck in. Yeah. Mate, it was quality. Unbelievable. Like, the, even the announcements and stuff, like the stuff I've been emailed yeah, since was, signing up. It's such a fucking well-run yeah, thing. It was originally, yeah. originally agreed to as a meme. And yeah, then, and now it's won an award at a football awards. Yeah, show. fair play. Mate, I remember on, on, on the day it started. It started off slow on the day, like we didn't have a football until one minute before kickoff. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, and really? and I, in my head, I was like, <laughs> "How do you warm up? How do you warm?" I just no, ran around the pitch. No one passed. <laughs> no balls passed to each no, other. Or anything. I think the other team had one. Our team didn't have one. Oh wow! Maybe that's oh. why we lost. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No one had a touch. But um, but from then on, there, then on, then on, then. Then on there. Then on there. Yeah. It was Decent. just uphill. It what team were you? Were you light blue? I was light blue. And if I, the word, Elliot Hackney. Bless him. Oh, He's big he had such that was Will. He had such a fucking stinker. <laughs> and he knows yeah, it. We were supposed, yeah, he we were, knows it. I put it on that. a plate for him. Yeah. I don't know Shocking. what he was thinking. Shocking. But it was yeah. unacceptable from Elliot. And if he doesn't improve next time, we're going to be having words. Well, you might not be on his team. I oh, fucking hope not. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's, oh, actually, he's actually one of the better he Shoreditch, Shoreditch five side players. Is. You haven't been there in a minute? Neither of you, actually. What's happening? I'm still the injury from Clash. When I no, tore, not me. When yeah. I tore my adductor. Right, and your excuse is? It's medical ass. You remember I hurt my cock sick? <laughs> Does that mean if I'm going like this? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Remember I hurt my cock six in Ibiza and I fell on my tailbone? Right. And I wasn't intoxicated. Yeah. I fell backwards and really hurt it. And it's still, yes. It's well, still it, now? Yeah, it's been really bad. I That's think I'll mean. be able to start playing next week. I'll, yeah. Just out of the, yeah? I, know, I do my own physio these yeah. days. I give myself my own time frames. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I do. You saw me try and kick a ball in Chris MD's video. 
I fell to the floor. Remember that? You put it top bins. Yeah, but before that, <laughs> <laughs> of course I put it top bins. <laughs> 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 have, you, have you received prize money that you've won from? Well, I, I, don't, I don't want to. Yeah. I don't want to. Obviously, I wouldn't hold your breath. Blasphemise yeah. Chris. <laughs> it wouldn't. No, if it's, if it's true, it's not blasphemy. But yeah. unfortunately, he did text me on Thursday saying, "I'm paying you this weekend." I have not received the money. It <laughs> is oh now dear. we are filming this on a Monday, and I have not received the money. So the debt collectors round. So we we I could be sending a true Geordie round any any second. Did you did you see me on the poker? I did. I I. Do you know what it was so funny because you just watched it. I'm going. They absolutely hate him. <laughs> they fucking hate him. You Wait, were just so Adam? under their skin. Adam McCola and yeah, Rory. Yeah. Oh, which is, which not is, even just them two. I could see Loz and which Loz is, and Brian losing which it is too. It's funny because both. Pairings of people around that table have podcasts on football. Yeah, <laughs> Theo was just like reasons. right in there. I was like, "That's my boy." <laughs> I was in the lion's den, yeah. living rent Rory, free. And you've had Rory and Adam on strings. Oh, yeah. it, it, when I when I beat Lawrence in a one on one, you could see his face. It's oh like, yeah, it, yeah. Prick. <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then I got really tired and decided to give up. I you got, didn't decide to give up. You I could have. You, 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 <laughs> it was won. always covered. It if was I, always if covered. I played smart, I probably could have done better. But I don't. Could you? Could you actually play smart if you wanted to? This is like the FPL discussion. I where, probably could play smart. Where when he starts going, but down. playing smart is also playing boring. So yeah, fair. no, yes. What? Wait, true, you did play you, boring. You played so boring during that. No, I played tight because I didn't know the people around the mate, table. That's you how you play poker, lost. mate. Yeah, you, mate, you won exactly the same money as me. That's fact. Nothing. Right, yeah. I had fun. I la- lasted longer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shut up, boy! I'll have any of you. Right, anyway, let's talk about football. Yep, footy podcast. Uh, yeah, exactly. It's a bit of a poor, poor start. Ollie out? Yes or no? Has to go. Has to go. Do you reckon? Oh, now with that squad, he but does. Think about oh, it, Fergie. Do you, re- do you reckon he goes Fergie before Liverpool? No, because I think that's their only hope as a result. I don't think he's going. I think they're backing him. They, they came out today and said they backed him, right? They have to. Fergie was in a very similar situation with United, you've got to remember, at the start <coughs> when he took over in the 80s. This is football knowledge. Um, <laughs> was it the 80s that he took over? Uh, was it, it the 90s? It was the 80s. 80s. It was the 80s. Right. Just double check. Come on, me. Um, yeah, he didn't have a very good start for like four or five years, yeah. I swear. Mm. And um, they backed him. They could. He was so close to getting fired. So close to getting fired. They heard the fans calling his head. You could argue that for any. You could argue that for fucking but Steve back Bruce. For like four, four years, he, five years. Ollie's been there. What three, two? That you could apply that logic to anything. Yeah. It wouldn't change the fact he's still a PE teacher. I can. <laughs> yeah. I can see that United squad. They should. You know. Yeah. Their they team should is be winning every game. Every their team is an yeah. absolute yeah. cheat code. Absolutely. Absolutely. Like, we talk about City being a cheat code, but United's first team is a joke. Yeah. It's yeah. an absolute joke. Even Mason Greenwood. Unbelievable, and he's done. You can't argue. He's done a brilliant job. Like from where he inherited them, where yeah. he's got them now. I yeah. just maybe think you go time for someone a little bit proper. Do you but then who the who? Dan, <laughs> really, really, yeah, yeah. But do we know he might have just had a good team and just yeah. fluked four Champions Leagues, which is a bit of a ridiculous thing I, to say. I but know, do we know? Yeah. So maybe maybe just that, maybe he relinks it with Ronaldo. So many people say that like Zidane fluked these three in a row Champions Leagues, and it's like. Oh, yes, he had a good team, but he's still the champions. Yeah, league, you're right. You're right. Yeah. It's just, I just don't believe. I, don't, I look at him and I don't believe he did anything. Like, yeah, I just don't I, believe I, he I, was I, going. Yeah, Ozil, Ozil give ball to Ronaldo. You you, you, the thing, got years ago. The thing is, in that in that Real Madrid team, there's like five or six leaders anyway. Yeah. So you don't really. Uh, I mean, do you need a manager at that point? They've yeah. got half half of the squad are managers in, in their own right. I feel anyway. like you need Zidane, someone like Zidane, just not Marcelo, Ramos, egos. It's probably a big ego battle in that realm. It's true, actually. Longest. You've got Zinedine Zidane telling you what you, to do. You, you pipe shut up down. and listen. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, exactly. True. What about... Who the, who but do, Ronald, but do, do Ronaldo? Do United do that if he comes there? I mean, Oli's a legend of the club. I like, I think if anyone's going to replace Oli, it will be Zidane. I think Conte, it's... So, Conte, but he wants to start apparently at the start of a new season. Yeah. He doesn't want to take on... I think Zidane, like he's, it's he's, always tough not, to he's not working at the moment. Mm. I think, why not give him a shot? Poch would have been the one before they let him go off to City. Yeah. Uh, not City, no. PSG. Yeah. yeah. Twitter. Fucking shit. <laughs> but I think Zidane would... I think he's he's, he's Zinedine Zidane. Yep. United are arguably the biggest, one of the biggest clubs in the world. Mm. Why would you not go for Zinedine Zidane? He's worked with Ronaldo. He knows how to deal with egos. And that club's full of probably quite a lot of egos. But do you, do you think that he's genuinely a good manager? Or do you think he just inherited a really good squad? Though? I think... Good name. He, I think he's got his adapt. Like, come on, he's a footballing. Br- his brain was ahead of everyone. Right. He's what? Got, what? That, what? That, no, that, hang on. Mate, it was. His brain is ahead of everyone. Yeah. If you look. Oh, at as him, a player, as a player. As a yeah, player, yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah. that will translate. Like, Xavi's doing an unbelievable job in Saudi Qatar. Arabia. Yeah, Qatar, whatever. But yeah. that, that, that. Makes, How do you what? 
That Lampard. Don't tell me you've watched a minute of Qatarian oh, football. Yeah. Me. Have you not seen the goal? One of the goals they scored. It so you watched obscene. the Twitter. So you watched the Twitter highlight, and yeah, now, you, you, now you're saying that Xavi's running Qatar Steven Premier League. Gerard. You've watched Al Hibab <laughs> goal skills and highlights, and you've gone right. Yeah, get him in United yeah. job. Another case, Stephen Gerrard. Yeah. Look what he's doing. Up yeah, but the he's uh, Steve, Steve, and, he what is, he and again, it, as it, no one's watched the Scottish you don't watch Scottish football. You d- yeah, you've never no. watched the game of Rangers. I have. Uh, old firm doesn't count. <laughs> no, Outside have. of the old firm, you've never watched the game. I watch Rangers all the time during uh, the betting competition. Doesn't count. Doesn't count. Watch all the time. You don't. I follow Stephen Gerrard. Have you watched Rangers play a single minute of football outside of that betting competition? Yes. That's not either European football or versus Celtic. Yes. Who? 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 Against Hibs. Bollocks. Bollocks! Did you sit there Absolute and watch Rangers shy, versus Hibs? I saw it. it was on Sky Sports at twelve thirty kickoff, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna sit down and watch Hibs. Your life has been fucking bleak, mind. Ah, <laughs> it's gone up a hill so recently. What, so okay, right. Let, so talking about that, uh, the Rangers game versus Hibs. What impressed you about Gerard in his, in his, manager, <laughs> in his managerial role well, for you to think that he's capable of taking on his a big connection job? with fans is second to none. <laughs> uh, he also broke Celtic's ten year reign. That's not the same game that I'm talking about. <laughs> 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 uh, the way his team fights for him. The Against like, Hibs. The likes of James Stavonier. Right. Unbelievable player. English as well. Uh, stop. Hang on, hang on. What are you doing? And we're, you're we're, just we're listening. Talking about, we're talking this about is, Gerard. This is fraudulent. I want to. I want to know. The, I want to know your opinion on why. Why Gerard is a good manager? Or why is Dan... This is in the context about the fucking United manager. Yeah. Why are we even? Why are we even brought him up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why, Rooney? No. 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 He didn't just, do a good enough job. He's on a dying, dying horse right yeah. now. I don't. I don't think he's done enough to prove himself that he's capable. Of I'd like to see Rooney have like a. They do, they've just a, sacked an old player manager. Yeah. That club does not need Give fucking Rooney. more ex-players. Yeah. It's all from the like the whole hierarchy. Darren Fletcher, he's in there somewhere. Yeah, yeah, gotta Fletcher? be, gotta be. Get yeah. a proper manager. Get a philosophy. I, I will, I would back the what's the Ajax manager's name? Ralph Glins? No, no, it's uh, Van Van Gerk or something. Right, let me. I, I'm double checking this because Van what Gerk. Ajax do at the moment mm-hmm. in terms of bringing up youth and turning out players is exactly what. Oh, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang just scored. Who? Aubameyang. Oof. Aubameyang. Who? One well, no. Anyway, yeah. Aubameyang. Who? One, one in Arsenal. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, I would go for the Ajax manager. I don't know. What, I can't remember what his name is. Right. So, but that, that, but just it's good though, eh? We don't, don't, we don't no, know his name. But he's just good with No, I mean, I can't, I, can't, I can't remember his name. I'll give Rooney, Ten a, Hag is I'll give Rooney a coaching role Ten, t- Ten Hag. I knew he was in the tip of my tongue. Ten Hag. But yeah, Rooney, but why would you... Put him in, in charge of the strikers. No, but you want, you, want, you want a manager that's there with a philosophy that will last f- for yeah. a long time. Not players that... Not more PE teachers. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm not saying Rooney give him the manager. I'm saying give him the coaching role for the strikers. But that's what they are. They're coaches. They're not managers. Yeah, I agree. I fully agree with you on that one. Yeah. Apart from Gerard, Gerard's a manager now. I, I, would, I think yeah. he's an unbelievable coach and he did it, He worked through his Ten Hag, with all the different Gerk. age groups Fuck but you know. he's a manager so Dan's a manager not a coach I feel like why bro what, what? yeah what separates them in your mind just because he wears like a long sleeve coat or something yeah. like, well, what is coaches it? wear trackies managers wear suits mm. <laughs> it's true it's true of course <laughs> it's true bollocks man <laughs> Oh god! I'm too in love with Arteta oh. for care about anyone else. Anyway, he's such a good manager. Would you Would you keep him? Like if yeah, if, no, if, if Graham Potter wrote World Star, I, I would, would keep Arteta. Arteta has a philosophy. He's and that's a philosophy exactly. And the, yeah. the, 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 the it's just not a very good one. Right now we're on the way. No, we are. It's we are progressing. Hey, it's progressing. Manager of the month. Three wins out of three. Steve Bruce won that last year. But I, I I think I think Graham Potter would be a really good appointment for United as well. Yeah. What for Man United? Yeah. Yeah. Oh well, both. I uh, I would take I would take him in a heartbeat. Yeah, purely because he's just used to working with shit players. Why don't Newcastle go after him? Um, I, I think you go. I don't. Maybe I, they have. And just, maybe they have, and Brighton have turned him down because yeah. I, I I just think that Brighton have got to do everything they can to keep hold of him. Did you hear Brendan Rodgers had a sixteen million release clause? Sixty. Sixteen. Sixteen. If you're really that rich, go go on, Brendan. Yeah, yeah but I mean. But Le- again, schools. Leicester probably don't want to. I, th- I think we will. Either, I, I think the the two names for us now are fucking Unai Emery, which is an improvement, and I can't turn my nose up at or Stephen Gerrard. He won Europa League, didn't he? Yeah, he just, he just, that is a weird cup, fella. Actually. That's I've, the Emery Cup. Really. I think I think honestly, Gerrard would be a such a good appointment for Newcastle because you know full well that he would connect with that fan base. Absolutely. I just I can't lie and tell you I've watched a minute of Scottish yeah. football to be like, yeah, he's the one. You for just got you. All you got to do is just trust that. It's not Steve Bruce, crack on. And trust that he broke Celtic's 10-year reign. 
Like, and he was quite good yeah. against Hibs. Yeah. Maybe. That's that the game that I watched. One hundred percent watched. Yeah. Hibs versus, Hibs versus, was it Rangers? You said Rangers versus Hibs. Yeah, yeah. that's the one I watched. One hundred percent. So what colour? Yeah, so Celtic versus Hibs. Wait, so what colour did Hibs play in? Uh, green. They do. Yeah. yeah. Good. I actually, I'm not even joking. I actually have uh, been to a Hibs Rangers game. That's what, a game. That's why I've said it. You've been to one. Yeah. Why? Uh, I was doing like a Sky Sports like four Jesus. games in three days thing. They pay you well. No, they didn't pay <laughs> bloody hell. But I got to meet Frank Lampard. Great. When I went to the Derby game, and that that dragged you all the way to Glasgow. And Colo Torre. Brilliant. Wow. Great. Yeah, and Brendan Rodgers actually when he was managing Celtic. They all were at Celtic. Yeah. Colo Torre and Brendan. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I forgot yeah. he was yeah, at Celtic. Yeah. yeah. Who's it's your um, it's such a random one? Who's your favourite Newcastle player of all time? Do you know what? I uh, so Shearer is kind of the obvious one. I've always been a Ben Arthur man. I like a, oh, I like a bombs oh, off. Oh, oh, like, to be fair though, I thought it'd be like I thought it'd be like uh, Kabu, Kabu, Kabai, Kabai. We bro, we have cult ballers. We're usually shit, Hatton. but we went like fucking yeah. Cisse and Bar, Kabai, Tio, yeah. Tio, a peace Kabu. be upon him. <laughs> Kabu, Kabu, I'm Ben Arthur. Johan Kabu. But, I think St. Maximin this season He's is growing, now clear. I think, oh, yeah, yeah, I think yeah. just... Because oh, yeah, yeah. could do it on both foot. Maybe Ben Arthur was a little bit more left-footed. Oh, very one His footed, attitude was horrendous and he got really fat. But fuck me, he was incredible. Yeah, no, I, was. Every year on FIFA, I just buy Ben Arthur. That yeah. solo goal. Oh, I, I still left. remember that solo. It's one of my favourite Premier I was at the goals. Bolton one. It was shit. Really? It was shit for 66 minutes and he just picks it up. And He's yeah, genuinely one box. of my favourite players of all time. Absolutely. Clear of Tarapt. Really? Absolutely. Yeah, I don't know about He's that. He's clear of as Oh, two of the on best the street time. ballers on in the Premier yeah, League. Yeah, that has to be. It's crazy that we didn't actually mention Ben Arthur at that point. Yeah, what in like street football players? Come but he, I, he, I don't think he was ever like street football. He was oh. more. He was just incredibly. He could skillful. just be anyone. Yeah, anyone he fancied. But he never. He'd never take the piss though. It was never yeah, like it would. It, bro. It he would never, beat a man and then go, oh, "Fuck, I'll go and beat him again." Yeah. Well, yeah, but I mean, like, I'm pretty but, sure but he would go. Yeah, no, oh, okay, like, go. yeah, disrespect. It wasn't yeah, like if you heard the disrespect. Yeah, like, shit There yeah, was a little bit less shit Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Was, he's my favorite. One of my favorite players of all time, by by far. Abs- what he's, Ben Arthur? Yeah, yeah. He just, just his peak was so small, and he and then fucking De Jong, especially when he, you remember Nigel De Jong? Yeah, he snapped his leg in two places. Oh my god, Where did where did Ben? Didn't he go to? Somewhere like PSG or somewhere at some Who, point. Who Ben no, Arthur? No, he, he went Leon and then he, went PSG. Yeah, yeah. Did he? Yeah. He he could have had. So, I know he had oh, obviously. Had where's a very he? Good where's career. he now? He's like probably Stad he's Rennes, in. Is he? It? I think he's playing. Is he not in Qatar? Is he? It wouldn't surprise. Oh, me. I think he's a free agent, or, or maybe not. Maybe. I, don't he's, know. I, I think he signed for um, R 9s team. Is that? Not oh, in, in Spain. No, R 9s team's in Spain. Is it? It's like Real Valladolid or something. I think you've made that up. We're guessing at this point. Yeah, we are guessing. I watched the R 9 documentary. No, no, but I mean. We don't know where he is. We've no, lost no, we're we've not sure. James yeah, is going to find out, we've though. We've lost yeah. the location of Ben Arthur, which I'm sure we'll find him at some point. If, he's a free he's agent. He's a free oh. agent. Well, thing is, though, it's just a disaster. Atletico it's, Magorda. That, yeah, Atletico, well, he fit in, fat mother. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he fit right in. It's true. God, Sign up for disaster. Garden FC, mate. He was quality, though. Oh, he was right. absolutely. All right, Pete. So would you say he was your favourite? Or is it St. Max he, at the moment? Oh, it's hard to say, because maybe it's recency binds. But of all time, I'd say Ben Arthur. All time, to, but like an, another one or two seasons, it could end up being. Uh, yeah, I think, well, that's a good thing about that's. Do you know what? I think that's the best thing about this takeover is now we have the prospect of keeping that fella for three, four years. Yeah, like, realistically, he was gone that's in January or yeah, yeah. June, right? That's, he's that's definitely exactly what I said. Like he's 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 that good. He's so good yeah. that he's like now valued as being good enough for the Newcastle. The new yeah, Newcastle. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Take it he's over. definitely one of the few players that will be there in two years. And yeah. Few's being generous. Yeah. Right? Few's being really generous. I reckon generous. you're going to get St. Max Day. Yep. I've got I've got, I've got to put faith in the boy Joe Willock. I also, yeah, if you buy, if you buy half 30 mil at that point, I have to, you, you have to do years, it. You have yeah. to do it. And then maybe who's your like who's you who's you got Elmer on and maybe Lascelles. maybe Wilson uh, Wilson Snackhead not really Lascelles. Do you know yeah, Jamal new- Lewis? Yeah, he, left back. He, we we bought him. He was shite for us, but he was really good at Norwich before. And so I, yeah. I'd keep one of the keepers. Dubravka, Dubravka and Odalo are both brilliant. Yeah, they're both. I really think they're good. both very equal, aren't they? Yeah. Like, you'd, yeah, you'd I'd, I'd go Dubravka. Yeah. The good thing with Dubravka is he's like he's quality for like a good six months at a time, and then he drops a fucking clanger like a Rob G- Green S yeah, clanger. Yeah, yeah. Then no <laughs> clubs sniff around him, and he stays at United for the rest of the season. He, does, he maybe doesn't purpose. Mate, yeah. so every six months he has a howler, and then he's great for the next like you know period yeah, and of then time. Just goes keep under him? the radar, absolutely. Yeah. Everyone just remembers that howler. Yeah. No one yeah, sniffs like around him, but he's yeah. brilliant. He's brilliant. I remember the Darlow performance against. Was it Darlow performance against Liverpool? 
where he, just, he made like 13 saves. I can't remember. He did, I know, it was I like do remember season. that. It was like last, remember last that. season. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's got absolutely it in Absolutely unstoppable. Those two are really good. Yeah. The I, think that, that, I think there's definitely a chance of either of them staying. I'd, I'd probably get rid of. You need like Kieran a Clark. I quite like him, but obviously he's gone. Shelby first one out the door. Fabian the second Shaw, name's long mate, you know, they're going. Shaw's a bit sexy, so maybe good to sell some shirts. <laughs> yeah. Shite also. Good You're gonna release the, the Longstar brothers. Oh god, yeah. Really? Awful, awful. You'll see them I like, for like crew or someone soon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you know that bad? Well, who's gonna sign Fucking him? Fucking Matty Longstaff playing for Aberdeen now. Oh, I think he's on, uh, uh, he's on loan in the depths <laughs> yeah. of Scottish football. There you go. Same point proven. What do you mean point proven? Point proven. <laughs> 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 I remember them. Who scored? The, who which one scored the world against United? Man the, United. Uh, Matty Longstaff. The little, the younger Long, one. Yeah, yeah. Matty Longstaff. He's. A, I swear that like cemented him in like Newcastle folklore. So that that goal did. Did you win that game? <laughs> I, I, all I remember is he... <laughs> How do you <laughs> run a football I swear, mate, podcast? I swear, no, that goal went in. A living. That goal went in and like he was just a Newcastle legend. He had a good moment. It was, it was on his... I think he was his full debut. The, Theo's... <laughs> <laughs> Um, I work in Theo's appreciation, work of, in patches. Theo's appreciation of how Newcastle United <laughs> works is solely based on the film Goal. Yeah. So if they do something that's like... Wow, they've gone down in folklore already, bro. Uh, <laughs> there's not much competition, mind. There's not much. That goal movie, you'd like, swear down. It's quality. That was my it's, it's, tarnished your, it's tarnished yeah. your opinion of what football is I see Newcastle like. as Santi's team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Santi's team. <laughs> like in my head, Santi was the boy. He was the man that played for Newcastle. Because mm. they, 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 in that film, they used real, gu- real matches and like, put did Santi into the match. I don't think they did. <laughs> I think the they match. just put some fellas yeah, into the match. No, because he took a free kick. It was, I swear to God, I, I might be making it. Maybe I'm deluded. <laughs> I don't know. But I'm pretty sure one of the scenes was he takes a free kick and he scores the winner. But it's actually like a Newcastle. Like, I think it's like Bill Lauren Robert or someone who yeah. scores it. Oh my God, what a player. Sorry. Yeah, Do you know what? Sure. I grew up thinking Lauren Robert was shit. My, really? Because well, I used to go to the games and my dad hated him. He's got, he's got no right foot. Da, da, da. And then you I watched my compilations he's scoring, like scorpion kicks. Yeah. yeah. Mate, I was yeah, eight years it's... old watching the pigeons in St. James's Park, <laughs> not really paying it. God, oh, Lauren Bear, he's fre- useless French tosser. Yeah. <laughs> but that's what it is. And then you go home and go, well, yeah, he's not got a right foot, but his left foot's like it's one of the best. Absolutely in the phenomenal. Yeah. Dad chatting out his horse. Same as Messi. He ain't got a right foot. Oh, shut oh. up, man. <laughs> <laughs> you, are, you're, you are ridiculous. Well, you're telling me he's got a right foot. Absolutely, his, yeah, his, his right foot, his, <laughs> his right foot would put yours to shame. <laughs> so can we? I know I get a lot of slander for this messy shit, but I do exaggerate a lot of this you stuff. Literally, yeah, you brought it on yourself. What do you mean? Yeah, you but get I, a do, lot of I do actually think you stoke the fire. Yeah, but I do actually like love him so much. You can't, oh, him you can't go back five on him now. times in one episode. <laughs> 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 it was just too easy, isn't it? It's oh. too easy to rattle them. Yeah, it's true. Speaking of, uh, who do we think is going to win the Ballon d'Or? Because <laughs> oh, I think. I've already said Salah and Levan- Levan- what, what Lewandowski. Lewandowski. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of the whole team argument? You know when it's like uh, Chelsea won the Champions League and then fucking Jorginho won Love Euros. Shite. But do you see the Emre Chan thing where he won like, was it like, I don't know, was it 2014 won the World Cup? Oh, and whatever. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And there was obviously no one shouted for him in 2014, yeah. did I, they? I, hate to, I know it sounds a bit harsh on Modric and that, but the fact that Modric won the Ballon d'Or that year was a fucking joke. He, he was I'm pretty... sorry, but oh, no. oh, he... He was quintessential to the success of the teams that he played in there. Okay, cool. It's not like Jorginho. And then did you see like, who, the stats who kind of gets like, brought along with them? The stats mm-hmm. of like Messi, Ronaldo and Lewandowski yeah. from don't, that year. Don't. I think people just wanted a break from those two. Actually. Yeah, get a bit bored. Point. I think that's what it was. It was but like, Levin-Golski. please, anyone at this point, but these so long two. as you do something half decent, we're, we're they done. They didn't even win the World Cup. Who? Croatia. No, they didn't, no. They just got to the final. That's still oh, very impressive. That. Well, yeah, but it's very impressive no, for a country that size. Like, come on. Uh, yeah, but they are a very good team. Don't get them wrong. Uh, yeah, but again, well, uh, Modric very important maybe. to that. Success. Yeah, he was a worldy player. To be fair, I'm still saying uh, Lewandowski. What was Salah's end to last season like? So was it good. Was it good? Yeah, I think so. Was it good? I think he's an argument. I can't remember. Right? He has to be. He has to be part. Of, like, his his top record. Three. Yeah, I think uh, he, uh, if he doesn't get top three, you yeah. know what? Oh God. No, I mean, this is actually. Come on. This is how I think it's going to go. All right. I think they'll give it to Messi. They will, because he won Copa America. Yeah, they'll yeah. give it to Messi. Lewandowski will get second, and, and Salah sadly, third. Yeah. Do you reckon? Yeah. One, two, three in that order? Yeah. That poor fellow was robbed of it last year. Mike. Yeah, fact, why did they just cancel it when it was so obvious? They could have just given it to him. Yeah. Like, they played a lot of the season still. Yeah, just send it to his... Oh, what, what Lionel it was? and Cristiano haven't done that well this year? Oh, oh, we'll give it. We'll, we'll give it but he got robbed. He gen- and he knows he got robbed as well. He's spoken about it, I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah. I was fuming, because he's like my favourite striker. Yeah. So no, what? 
You just never know. You, why are you changing it every single time we do one of these? No, you know Lewandowski is my favourite striker. You said Ronaldo was. No, I didn't. Ronaldo's your goat. You yeah, said. he's my goat, but he's not my favourite striker. But he's a striker and he's your goat. So how does that matter? Yeah, he's, Ronaldo's in a different league. Like Lewandowski's like, it's, uh, can you just let me love them both? All right, fine. Like, I'd always buy Lewandowski when he was like 79 rated non-rare for Dortmund mm. on FIFA. And he was yep. just incredible. Yeah. What would you do? if? What's your celebration if you... Bag the winner in Clash of Creators final. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big deal. No, because I thought you were going to go bigger. Have you thought of these I things? You, you, go... you sit in the mirror and think of these things. Uh, only ever since I butchered my celebration after the solo goal at Wembley Cup. What was that? Just It, it was like that. It was just like, oh, what have I done? Oh, shit. <laughs> it was just me like panicking. Like trying like not fanning to... himself. I was like, oh, God. Cool down. Like, I just I... think if you over-celebrate a charity football match, right, I think Morg's over-celebrated his tapping and looked like a tit. <laughs> I love him. I love him a bit. But... I think I don't know. Maybe maybe that, but that I don't even think that looks no context. Shearer, not yeah, Hitler. Shearer. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, there's no hope. It doesn't even come to my uh, head. I wish I did a knee slide. Uh, like a creators, knee slide, yeah. Uh, or yeah, but uh, on the Astro, oh, it would hurt. Yeah. So yeah, if it's if it's grass, a knee slide. Why don't you wear leggings into the, into the, or like you know? Oh, oh, it'd be awful. What's that one on FIFA when you press a few buttons and they'd all be like dancing in uh, for last year oh yeah no, and then uh, they go yeah. <laughs> you have to chore- choreograph the, uh, the, the, the goal celebration uh, the, the Matuidi Movello when he goes like that which one do it again first sorry the Matuidi Movello when he's like one more time oh shut up man <laughs> right so. are you ready for this one can we do it now can we do it can we do the quiz now I want to get the, I've, I've been working on the quiz for a long time today what's the quiz so oh ev- yeah yeah every week we do a quiz Oh, no. And it's a five-question quiz. Oh, no. The best ones we've got so far. So Chris got three. Yeah. James got three. Ben Foster got one. And Spencer ben. got three. Right. What do you think you're going to get? Five. <laughs> yep. Good. And you don't know these ones either. No, I don't. I don't. You don't know these ones. Well, you... usually I test out the quiz on him. Right. Yeah. It's and true. you don't know it. And he, well, he was incredibly late, so obviously. Yeah. What do you think I was doing? Making the quiz. Making the quiz. Crafty blank. I, 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 <laughs> I, I hope they're not too easy. Right, well, go on. Well, like, could okay. you just give us these quiz questions? Question number one. Petr Cech has the most clean sheets in the Prem with 202. Who has the second most? Ooh. Long term keepers. Was Peter Schmeichel wasn't Prem. It was, it was just in the pre- Oh, you've got to think like early 2000s. Oh, I have no. I am impartial mm. to this one. Yeah, I, I'd say Reeve. You can work it out together if you really want. Really? If you, I'll, you know, I'll give you this. I'll give Can't you. Can't be Lehman. Surely that wasn't Who, long enough. Who's, who's been in a successful team that keeps a lot of clean sheets? That would be my logic. That would be my, my thought. And that's been around for a while. Maybe like Tim Howard. I can tell you something. Surely not. I did. Tim I did know the answer to this without having to Google it. Obviously, I googled Wait, it. What? Pe- Pepe Reina. Are they, are they, are Pepe they, Reina might be a shout. Do you reckon? Pep, he, that was a long time he was at Liverpool. I don't know if they're any good. Is his favorite? And Aston Villa. <laughs> All right, so you added about four or five on there. <laughs> <laughs> Pepe Reina, uh, who else do you think? Chelsea keeper. Uh, well, while, while you're thinking, better, if then... you, obviously play along and don't cheat in the comments. Tough, Put your comments man. down below. One to five. But remember, okay. don't cheat. Been around for a while. Is it Ben Foster? <laughs> it might be Ben Foster. It's absolutely not Ben Foster's second amount of clean sheets. He's played for a load of teams, but they're all shite, right? <sighs> I would lock in Pepe Reina. So I'm, you're saying Pepe Reina. I want to go someone, someone outrageous well, like, like, a, like, a six place, like so. Brad Friedel or something, but I don't think that's... God, that's a name from... Yeah. Uh, was it? That's an interesting did he play for He played for Spurs as well, didn't he? Mm-hmm. Blackburn. Oh, that's tough, man. I don't know. Oh, I've got you on the ropes, lads. I've got you on the ropes here. Yes, it's it's only really, mine wouldn't be right if he's saying I'm on the ropes. It's only really check that you, like... If I said who's number one, you'd know it's check. Yeah, but Wait, so that's, the, yeah. that's the only one that you really remember, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Arsenal, United, who... Oh, De, De Gea's been there at me. Yeah, I was thinking maybe they have De Gea as well. Yeah, Mourinho. Le- Lehman at managers. Arsenal as well, but... Uh, the clock is ticking. The All clock right, is let's ticking. Just, let's just I'm going to stick with Pepe I'm going to stick with Pepe And I'm going to say... De Gea. You both stink. <laughs> it's so obvious. Who was it? David James. Is it? Oh, really? 169. Wow. Lovely fella, him. Yep. 
really no top guys. Think about how many teams he played for and the long stint at Liverpool. Yeah, it's uh, true. City. Uh, I've, well. I've criminally underrated him there. Yeah, yeah David James. That. And it was a big deal when Czech overtook him. Fuck him, what's the next question? <laughs> <laughs> Which player has made the most European appearances for Newcastle? Oh, this is oh, Will's question then, uh, surely. Uh, but Shiro was always crock. You have to, you have to think, think, work this one out logically as well. What do you mean work it out? Ooh, could be Shea Given. Could when be. When were they in the Europeans? Uh, in the Europeans? In the Europeans. <laughs> when oh, were they the in Europe? Europe? Competition. I can't really remember. It was more like early 2000s. But then, oh, we're counting like night, because I haven't got a fucking clue if it's like late 90s. It was about two. <laughs> it's all European competitions. Oh, God, this could be quite ugly, this. Uh, I'm, I'm going to say Shearer. Oh, do you want to look at an answer? Uh, oh, fuck, but I'll give him. Uh, it's wrong. It's it might. I think I think he's probably right with given, maybe. Is he? I'm going to change it to... You've got me head. Most appearances. In European football for Newcastle. I'll be honest, lad. At that time, I just cared about Pokemon. And <laughs> I really, really asked. Uh, fucking Shea Given. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> Correct. Twenty. Oh, 20. 20 appearances. God. I guess you were second. Shearer. Uh, yeah, Shearer. Oh, right, oh, nice. nice. Right. Yeah. God, it's not that many, is it? Twenty. Twenty. Sure, Amiobi once scored at the New Camp. Fun fact, please. Wow. Really? He did. Yeah. That's quite cool. Oh, no. That is very cool. That's cool. Right. Which of these four clubs yep. are the oldest? Oh, okay. Reading, Notts Forest, Wrexham, Notts County. Notts Sol- County, oldest club. Thank you, yeah, Notts County, thank you very much. I would lock that in, final Notts answer. Notts County is the oldest club I did by actually, a mile. On, on my mother's life, I did actually, I was pretty certain that was Notts County. And that's where their kits formed from. So Newcastle's I, kit is originally nabbed from Notts County. No, Juventus. Hmm? It's Juventus. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. One of them. Right. Two out of three, fucking keep them coming. <sighs> you fucking bastard, Reeve. Yeah, it's his quiz. You said we let, could yeah, both let him answer it. First. You said we're working together. Okay, two out of three. All uh, right. Yeah, so every I'm year, like, keep... every year, Notts County have a friendly against Juventus. Is that the? Re- I, yeah. I knew it was one of the black and white teams. Yeah. God damn it! I've said some outrageous. Two out of three. Shit two out of three. Yeah. Mm. You're born, mate. You're mate, born. Ben Foster stinks of shit. Uh, football knowledge. He's lovely a fella. lovely chap. L- yeah, lovely he genuinely chap. is a fucking. Uh, this diamond one's bloke, a true or false. But he stinks of shit. <laughs> true or false? So Alex Ferguson has managed the Scotland national team. False. Oh, I don't. Ooh, false. Yeah, false. The answer is true. Ah, oh. I believe it was this 1967. He managed four games. 67. I think so. Right. So a year after we won the World Cup, which maybe not. We sing a song about. There's like 50 years ago. It was. Exp- he was probably like eight. <laughs> sorry, let me take that back. Yeah. Well, maybe not eight. Maybe no, like sorry, 18. Uh, 1985 to 1986. All right, fair so enough. 20, 20 years Yeah, different. only 20 years he away. He played for Scotland in 67. Ah, uh, okay, fair enough. He managed in between Aberdeen and Man United. Okay, cool. So that's two out of four. Two out of four. This is to equalise. Qu- to be minute. level with Chris MD on ball knowledge. I'll 90th take that. minute. These are harder questions, I think. I sort of based them, yeah. Anyways, yeah, yeah. anyways. anyways. Um, this is a who am I? Okay. Ooh, Ooh nice. Fair baker. Um, <laughs> he didn't say it, he didn't say it. <laughs> I have made 233 appearances for Newcastle. Over two spells, scoring 37 goals. I'm so popular. You got hiccups. Yeah, I did, yeah. <laughs> I'm so popular in my home country, they televised my wedding. I was the first of my nation to play in the Prem. Who am I? Two spells. Tino Espria, they love him in Colombia. Uh, is, he, is he an old player then? Is this an old player? Two, two spells. Yeah, to come back to Newcastle. And in the Prem... Uh, 37 goals oh in the Prem in the Prem two spells in the Prem uh, I was my f- I was f- uh, all I'm saying is I was the first of my nation to play in the Prem 233 appearances in two spells 37 goals I'm so popular at home they televised my wedding Tino Espria Un- answer for you I'll go with whatever Will says he's a genius incorrect oh. uh, and you're going to kill yourself no, 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 you're going <laughs> to <laughs> you mean kick yourself you're going to kick yourself <laughs> hang on wait wait it's not Craig Bellamy no, think think South American. Oh, you're going to... Yeah, you're going to... No. Nobby uh, Solano. So, uh, oh. Is it, is it, really? They televised his wedding? Yeah. I didn't think he had that. He's a Peruvian Peru. hero. Really? 95 right. appearances in Big Nobby. Interesting. Yeah. And he was one of my... I loved him. He played for Villa. Mm. Yeah, they, they nabbed him off us, right? Yeah. Did he, was, when did he play t- for us twice? Then? 
Um, did he come back up? Yeah. Oh, I think he was towards the end. He came back in uh, two God, seconds. Nobby Solano. A lot of people watching this may not even have heard of Nobby yeah. Solano. Yeah, it might have been a boring podcast all about fucking research, Newcastle United. It's unbelievable. <laughs> for the uh, so few people out there. 98 to 2004, and then he p- went for Villa for a year, smashed yeah, it, back. and came back for two years. God, I don't remember oh that. Oh, boy. Again, put him yeah. on in Yu-Gi-Oh. So you got <laughs> two. two so better than Ben Foster. So up your Two out of five. <laughs> yeah? Sling your hook, Ben. That's not bad. I say that wasn't bad. Would, would the questions are okay? Questions were tough. They were good. They were good. They yeah. were. Yeah. yeah. It was one. Of, I feel like it was one of them ones, like with the David James thing. Like once you got told the answer, you'd be like, oh. Yeah. But so. that's that. That question is you. Everyone knows check as the answer, but the top f- from second to fifth. I wouldn't be able to tell you. Yeah, that's why I am the quiz master. It's true. I am the quiz master. Don't you worry about that. If we flip this back on you, surely it's like ones or zeros. I would have got David James. Yeah. I well, probably you read it. But like, <laughs> no, I, I know that. Oh, okay. I know. I would have probably third? got Solano because I love him. Hmm. Who's third? If you know the keepers. I only looked at the top two. All right. Very I don't believe in. I, don't <laughs> I only know them because I googled them before. I don't believe in third place. Okay, that's me changing it. I do really. Um, do we have our results from last week, Jamie, in terms yeah, of they're, scores? They're, we're not doing very well. We, so every yeah, well, every week we do a uh, prediction, a uh, score prediction. So far, we got we we're, we're on three at the moment, but we what both said score, Arsenal. What do you mean? You do a score prediction of what? Uh, every so, game. So you know, you say home win, away win, or draw. Yeah. Just for each. Game. Oh yeah. So we'll get you to do that at the end of this. Brilliant. But yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, before we do that, we obviously want to continue this section because. It's part and parcel oh. of the podcast. Wee. We're back to footballer funny stories. Da, 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 da. We get people to send in the weirdest, wildest places they've met a footballer. Oh, that's quality. So before we do any of the public ones, yep. have you got any That you're allowed to ones? say. Yeah, that Talk, you were allowed to say. Uh, nothing particularly funny. Took a piss next to Shearer once. That's, oh, that's cool. cool. Yeah. That's uh, cool. Did you... I didn't look at his cock. No. I was oh. about eight, so I think probably. Oh, okay. yeah. Well, maybe not eight, like 11. Uh, footballer, funny stories. Nah, no. Uh, embarrassing story because of you this week. So, as you know, I could not get a ticket to that Newcastle game at all. So I put in the group chat, you know, fucking can't get a ticket. And everyone goes, message St. Maximin. Oh. <laughs> message St. Maximin. I was like, no, I can't do that. I can't bring myself. Well, bear in mind you've spoken to him before. Bear in mind, right? Like, we've gone <laughs> back and forth. You'll send us some fucking laughing and fire yeah, yeah. emojis. You know, I'll link him a fucking gif of him putting it some, somewhere. <laughs> yeah. like, you're like, my bro, my bro. And then he sent me a shirt and signed the shirt. That's sick. He's Mia good. put it in the wash so it's not longer shined. Oh, um, oh no. So, long story short, I, I message uh, our pal Alan and I'm still I'm still yet to hear back. He got aired. And oh. now, our good, strong relationship that I had in my head is just shattered. Tarnished. Yeah. Shattered. Because so, you yeah. can't delete messages. Fuck him, sell him. Can you, you delete, him. can you delete messages on Twitter? <laughs> no, I don't think you can. Well, I can delete it for me, but not for him. Yeah, yeah. So it's still there. That is the worst. It's yeah. still there. I'm so like, thank yeah. you. Because I was there was no way I was going to do it. And then you, Ethan, and Carl were like, you know, you've got to Yeah, because we him. thought you were the boys. I thought, well... Uh, I've actually had a very similar situation to that. Have you? But I'm, I won't, yeah, I'm not going to say who it have is. Have you explained your Christian Fook stamps ever? We were just buddies. <laughs> have, you just, seen, have you seen how weird his yeah, Christian yeah, Fook stamps? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was a boy. He was a fucking ledge. Yeah, he's a, he wants, he, he wants to be a kicker. NFL, he, he does. Yeah. yeah, I want to be a kicker. He now. wants to sling one up you, mate. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's gonna. This is gonna get out of context. Don't you ever miss? Because um, bright dear me some interesting stuff. Yeah, back. mate. I don't know if you saw, but we went for an NFL day recently. Yeah. And my word, were they impressed with my kicking ability? I saw ability. that. And I was like, he's gonna be such an arsehole about that. Oh, I was. I saw you nail it. I was the. Oh, you did. You weren't there. I wasn't there. But oh, I was. My word. I was at the game yesterday. The what. Jags uh, Dolphins game. Oh, it was quality. It was, it, there was a 53 yard field goal. And if you weren't in being, the, if you weren't being paid to say that, what would you say? I wasn't paid. You actually Ooh. like it with a straight face. I, I support he Miami Dolphins. I left, yeah. I left my NFL game at half time because I fell asleep. But that was two, three years ago. I, uh, is the check cleared? The check's it, cleared. It, it right? was off the back of I just travelled from. Being paid? No, no, no. This is three it's years still, ago. You still yet to get paid for the. No, I love the NFL week. now. <laughs> Yeah. I love the NFL now because I started watching the Amazon Prime yeah. stuff. Back then, I'd just right. driven from the have AJ ever, Have you ever watched like, the Netflix stuff on like... Uh, the last, the last, last, last yard, yard or something? Sick, yeah. sick. Yeah, okay. it's so but these, So these Donnies here with... with <laughs> longest yard. Well, <laughs> well, last yard, longest yard. <laughs> yeah, that, that you know, they're they're, 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 they're like 25, 26 <laughs> in that show now, so their last chance to get back on it. These guys that we were doing the stuff with, mate, they're about six for eight. And he's 17. Yeah, Jesus. I was like, you what? The, how? Hog the size of a fucking... Oh, it has to be. <laughs> I'm just like, you are... What the fuck? 
how are you a human? And they're go they're, some of them are D one players. They're going over to America. Oh, college D one. Yeah, wow. I got a. I, I managed to get a forty five yard field goal. That's impressive. Is that when you you just boot it? You know, yeah. forty five yards. No one else could do. Yeah. It. So so the final kick of the game on fifty three yesterday, fifty three yards yeah. with a second to go. And they, they, had, they had five seconds to go, and they were uh, they were fourth and six. So they had to make six yards. They'd made loads of sobs. I still think it's a bit shade. You don't know what that means. I don't know what fourth and six means. Uh, so it's their it's their fourth down, and they have to make six. How many points? Why are we making these dumb How many points were they behind? Uh, they were level, so it would have gone to overtime. So basically, they kick it. They win. last minute winner. Yeah, pretty much. So it's, score it, to it win. Was, it, it, it was like <laughs> the equivalent of like a last minute winner on a. I reckon they can keep it. Keep it over there. Yeah, yeah, no, it's better than other Americans. Like it's base, going to Germany baseball as well. shite. It's going Germany. Yeah, I don't, I'm not a fan of baseball. What the, what the Germans are? You know what? NFL, like, NFL is like it's a show. I feel like it's more of a show. Yeah, it was, like, it I do, was I so do enjoy it. it really it's more about the fucking halftime thing and the special yeah. adverts. The Super Bowl, yeah. Rudimental played. I tell you, it's too like, American for my like, and I'm not a the fan. The actual kicking thing, I, I loved it. I really did. Yeah, the sports sick, man. I loved it. Like, they are. His one job. His one job is come on and kick. That's it. No, no, it's really? hard. It's hard. Yeah, because no, because yeah, he was like, they're running at you and yeah. you're only allowed a certain amount of steps. It's harder. And it obviously, hard. I did it a lot easier than it I was meant really to. It's really hard. But he was impressed. The only was issue he, is, was he, he was did genuine. You, did you do a good and kick? I did it, and then I did it left footed as well. He was like, fucking hell, mate. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but I couldn't walk the next day. Yeah. I legit could not walk the next day. I was just like, oh my God, yeah. my body is broken. It's high intensity NFL. Yeah, 100%. They're RIP. Proper athletes. And then, did you see the one? They chucked it from the top of the Spurs stadium. They told us to catch it. Oh, did anyone? No. Does that not like injure you? It's like an RPG coming at you. <laughs> it was outrageous. It la- I, I, I got it on my arm. So my friend Luke caught it. Well, he didn't catch it. Like, hit his arm. Yeah. His, the bruise was just ginormous. Jesus. It's an RPG coming down at you, mate. It's outrageous. It's a stupid fucking sport. But it's better than a lot of the things that have come out of that country. <laughs> it be- it's better than cricket and it's better than rugby. Better than rugby? Oh, rugby's fucking wild. Oh, I tell you what, I love a rugby World Cup. You're just a fucking wrong yeah. Check the heart. I hate nah, rugby. On it. Check the heart. I hate, I, I hate rugby with a passion. Should we do but some stories? It's not yeah, yeah. rugby. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Sorry. Right. Right. Rugby, there's no, <laughs> rug, rug, rugby, 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 there's no 10 minute breaks in between each, each play. Right. Okay. okay. But it's full of arseholes. Story number one. A few years ago, I was in Morrison's grabbing a meal deal, of course, as you do. I was deciding what I wanted. Man like Stylian Petrov Man was there like... also looking to buy a sandwich. I said hi. He was lovely. I then went to pay and guess who is next to me with the same sandwich. You guess it, Petrov. Oh, wait, no. That's you're telling, crazy. You're so telling well. me Petrov picked up a sandwich and went to pay for it. Oh, oh, the same as his, apparently. Oh. So I believe what was I it? helped him decide his lunch that day. Right. Uh, we'll move on to the next one. <laughs> Lads, get this. <laughs> silly. He I thinks he decided Petrov's lunch. It's pretty impressive. That's shade. Yeah. That's, quite That's shade. All right, anyway. Question, uh, question, story number two. Um, so, yeah, if you've got any stories, please send them in. They're probably <laughs> we're, we're <laughs> okay. Good evening. I, I met Phil Neville in a Starbucks in London. He oh, got yeah. annoyed at me for taking a photo of him without asking <laughs> because what I was actually doing was trying to show my girlfriend a photo of him on Google to show her who he was. He laughed with me afterwards and, and then took a photo with me. Oh, on his Instagram oh, no. story about an hour later, he went to meet David Beckham. Oh. I wonder if it was brought up in conversation. Probably not. No. Are they the best we've got? No, well, that's the only two. That's the only two. Oh, come on. I want... Guys, you can do so much better <laughs> than that. I it. I, want... re- I, I, I don't want to, you know, dis- discourage the people that have sent them in. And Absolutely. The, I just read out the two stories from the people that sent in and now hate me and Theo. But, you need yeah. shot. But come on, guys. There's a, there's a few I can say. I was, I would, you know, I mentioned the AJ fight before I went to the NFL. Yeah. That yeah. night, um, I went into, I was quite drunk, went into the cubicles, I'm between the urinals, going for a wee. I looked to my right and I'm like, fucking hell, who is this? He's about six for eight. It's Martin Johnson. No idea. He lives in England. He, lives, he comes from it, where I live. England World Cup winning rugby captain from 2003. Yeah. Uh, Mate, that's. that's a, bro, he lives, no, he, he lives he, where my parents live. He won the World live. Cup. He lives where my parents live. Next from, door. Yeah, Leicester Tigers. I can't believe yeah. it. He was ginormous. Mate, he won the World Cup for England. Did he? Well you, done. You, well you're done. Not, you're really not a rugby job. fan. You're not I a rugby fan. Rug, well in Martin. Well, really well done. 2003, Johnny Wilkinson. Yeah, everyone, yeah, yeah. Everyone remembers Oh, I met him. That's met the him. drop kick. You met Johnny Wilkinson? Yeah, well, he's in Newcastle. He teaches oh, how to do he, rugby he, kicking he once. I thought Newcastle. he was fucking shade. Really? It's shit, man. He's right foot, left foot, both. That's what he wants. Good looking fella, like. Is he? Oh, he's a great looking fella. He's the same as a bit injury prone, wasn't he? Yeah. Sexy fuck right there. That's all right. That's all right. Uh, I'm trying we... to find some more stories. You guys. That's it. There's no more fucking footballers. You've filmed with footballers, haven't you? 
Do you know what? No, well, I mean, I, I never really did the football challenges for obvious reasons. Uh, me, me, me and Harry filmed with David James like two or three, four weeks ago. Lovely guy. I tried to chip him and then I missed every other penalty. Oh, oh a few weeks ago? Yeah. Recently, just in Stratford. Um, with the footballers, no, I'm not filmed. Um, no. No? No. Oh. No, do I, I'm not, you know what I mean? It's not really my yeah. gig, is it? I um I don't know if I told this one. I, I met. I got another one. Oh yeah, go on. <laughs> I've got so many I could just name them all. Uh, Jamie just said it to me. Okay, please can I stay anonymous? But I've got a great story about running into a footballer. Oh, here we go. I live in Australia, and when Manchester United came on tour in 2019, I was at a restaurant the day before they played in a game against one of Australia's teams. I sat down and started eating, and halfway through the meal, I noticed Andreas Pereira and Marcus Rojo sitting on a table United next to biggest us. Biggest names. I kept eating and didn't bother them the next night. Tell me this gets better, Reeve. Oh, the night went on, but out of nowhere, the two of them started throwing stuff at each other and eventually <laughs> it turned onto a full-on food fight. <laughs> they walked out with Sprite all over their shirts and food all over them. I so. think there's, a, there's another one, actually, if you pass that phone. I've seen there's another one. No, honestly, you can, trust me, you can trust me, you can trust me. I was told there's another one a bit further down. Uh, this is from a guy called Stephen. And he says, I work at Arsenal's training ground. No way. He says, I clean the showers. And one day I saw Martin Odegaard and Alexander <laughs> Lacazette. <laughs> oh, it says, I can't read the rest after that. Oh, but yeah, mental stories. Very good. Where do you get the name from? What? The name's Stephen. Uh, the said, first name that came to your oh, head about that. It's supposed to be anonymous. Sorry, Stephen. Sorry, Stephen. <laughs> so the moral of the story Thanks, of that United one is they're immature. And they got drunk and they had food fights. Yeah. yeah. You would never see Ronaldo doing that. that. That club needs real discipline right now. <laughs> yeah, they've got CR7 showing them not to eat brownies. And look at yeah, them. no food fights around And look CR7, how that's done for them, eh? Yeah, Brilliant. That's true. Where are they not? Like sixth? Fifth? Yeah, you can't, you can't really have a food fight with salad, can you? It doesn't really, <laughs> doesn't really throw <laughs> salad. Fair point. I, I went to uh, Roger Federer at 3 a.m. in a nightclub. That's not a footballer story. <laughs> oh. Well, he's a sports Carry on. star. He's a sport, right, yeah, 3 a.m. in a nightclub. Rog, Big Rog was just chilling. Not a footballer. Well, he's one of the greatest tennis players of all time. You've, you've, you come out with a rugby player, a tennis player. Well, who's, what do you want me to say? I saw Marcel Desailly with about... With the what? With the what? With the what? <laughs> 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 he was living his best life in that Give moment. me odds oh, of reading, of letting me read one Christian Fuchs DM. <laughs> Just give me odds. Stop making it sound weird. Oh, well, oh. if it's not so weird, let me read one. No. <laughs> <laughs> Just one. Mate, you got a funny shade of red. Have you got any plans for this week in terms of fantasy football? Um, and this isn't us trying to oust you in terms of. Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay, I think, yeah. It is. Uh, I, I, I want Wilson back in, but our run isn't great. I'd maybe get rid of Alan because, you know, he got me no tickets. No, I'm kidding. Bastard. I'm kidding. <laughs> um, I'm just going to put Townsend in for Ben Rama. Thinking maybe right. I've, I've lost hope in Ben Rama. Yeah. But no, have you got any hints? Because usually that's what I pace my team off. I was going to go for Ben Chilwell. Were you? Do you yeah. think he's starting? It's a lot, it's a but that's, that's what I'm basing it off. That's what I'm waiting for Wednesday's game. I'm waiting for Wednesday's game against oh. Ma uh, Malmo and so seeing if Alonso or Chilwell starts, then whichever one isn't. You play the other one. I'll, I'll the other one watch in. them doubles. Like watch Alonso start and then Alonso start the weekend as well. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck that. Surely it's Azbil Aquetta. Because surely he's nailed. It's, he, it's, it's other, James Tuchel. He's the side though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah but he's nailed. nailed. Surely. I've already got him. Fair. Oh, William. You talk about Townsend. They got Watford next week. Yeah, they hey, do. Honk. Yeah. Hey, honk. Does he play right wing? He does. He does. Mate, that's an easy fucking gig now. Yeah. <laughs> and then Demar Gray on the left. I tell you what, my team's looking. I, I, I bought Diaz in. I rolled Stupid my. Hell. I rolled my transfer, so I mm. had two two players: Demar Gray and Diaz. Diaz benched Pep Roulette. For, for someone who plays so far forward, Cancelo doesn't really return anything. Like he in terms of clean sheets, he, he did yeah. last year. Didn't Never he? really shows lively, up. as they say. Mm. Him and him and Tariq Lamptey. Yeah, I might. I'm debating bringing in Cucurella. Is what happened to Lamptey? He's back. Is he? he got, uh, Veltman got subbed off on the 59th Is minute. He, what happened to him? Just clean sheet. Oh, my God. 59th. <laughs> oh, yeah. 59th. Yeah, imagine That's if you still had Veltman. That would be that'd chaos. That would be gutting. But yeah, Tarek Lamptey's back. Fitness. Full fitness. Cucurella's the one. He plays left wing, but he's a left back on the game. That's a show. Yeah. But so in else? Brighton, we trust. Mm. Yeah, I think um, you, have to, you have to back the informed teams at the moment. Graham Potter, mate. Mate, well, we here. stand Graham Potter. What a fucking hero. I might put... Um, who's who's got? They've got a tough Malpai. game. Malpai. At Brighton. Yeah, Manchester City. Pretty tough. Pretty solid. Yeah, yeah. yeah not the easiest. No, yeah, they do. Oh, they do. What do you mean they do? Yeah, that's why. I'd, yeah. So I'm just looking at the. I'm um, just looking at my team. So, who do you think will win the Premier League? Uh, at this point, anyway, given the fact yeah. that we have eight game weeks of information, and City. a lot of a lot of that information is now accurate, 
because obviously when Lukaku and Ronaldo arrived, mm. everyone's decisions were very, very swayed by He's their got to stop honking, though. He's got to stop Which honking. one? Both. Lukaku. Oh, yeah. I okay. think Ronaldo might be finished. Yeah. But <laughs> Lukaku has got... <laughs> Good. Good. I'm not. I'm actually better than that. <sighs> I'm not going to rise to it. Rise to it, Theo. <laughs> I'm a bit bored of City, so I'm going to go Chelsea. I would say I Liverpool, y- but they're going to get fisted by the African I Nations. I said That's Chelsea. True. That's true. I said Chelsea. Yeah. I said Chelsea, but I really think Liverpool can... But it, 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 Cal seems to think it's not going ahead, African Cup of Nations. No, it, it, it is, but I, I think Liverpool are going to do their absolute best to try and keep yeah. hold of those two. Because Mate, if, if Liverpool best. get rid of Salah and Mane, it's yeah. over. Fucking Origi for How six many, weeks. Yeah, that's the problem. It's, it's Origi and Jota. Jota, Jota Firmino, <laughs> Origi. Origi is a, he's a legend at the club, though. What were you going to say? It, you went... F- it's a folklore, but I've realised he's that, a folklore. Oh, he's a folklore. folklore. Yeah. I thought you were going to say fraud again. To be honest, I no, Rigi's like not you a fraud. Keep just chucking out that. Rigi, <laughs> you can't call him a fraud. What he did to that club, yeah, he got him in it. Um, so we Wait, got what did, what did he what did he score? Oh, oh fraud, fucking, fraud he was the trend. corner from the corner, yeah. wasn't it? Yeah. I was thinking the, the second one in the final, or so obviously Arsenal Brighton hasn't. Yeah, he did as well. Fi- finished. Yeah, but he did. Didn't really count. No. Really. That game Brighton. was done after two minutes. Scored against us, I suppose, when they were trying to win the league. Big goal. Yeah. Yeah. Still. He's big just quite D-Mark. good, isn't he? He's a big game player, Rigi. So wait, so you said Chelsea. Chelsea, but I really think City. I, 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 I think it could be any of those three. Yeah. And oh. I think... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's just quite obvious though, isn't it? Is it? Well, yeah. Who, who's going to win the league? Probably Chelsea, City or Liverpool. Well, yeah, yeah, that's the question. There's three teams to pick from. Yeah. Okay. It's well, not well. quite obvious, but there's... I don't know. It's quite obvious there's three teams to pick no, from. No, but what, I'm, what I mean is I don't... I don't, I don't, un, I, you don't know who's it going to be. It's un, it's yeah, I'm. I'm, well, you know, I'm I want, I want it to fence, come down man. to give it, let it come down to the final day. That's again. what I mean. Give That's, us, give I'd us love, another I'd love Aguero it to be, moment. I'd love it to be a really interesting and enticing title race rather than I think someone could, just could sprinting throw, away with it. Don't say United. No. The Arsenal. All right, let's move on. I'm being Good. serious. Lovely. I'm be being serious. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being serious. Could you throw us in the mix? I oh, mate. No, we're, we're too you far could. behind. Mate, Where are you? mate, last season, you're not even too, you're last just season, shit, from bro. Christmas to the end of the season, second in points. Bro, three games che- in. Chelsea, you lot Chelsea made us do like, You lot have lost your us. head. And now look at us. One way ticket to Mars. You beat Spurs and who else? <laughs> have, you, have you beat a top nil, side? 0-0 to Brighton. It's true. Title contenders. <laughs> yeah. One nil up against Palace at the moment. They've just equalised. What? No, I'm just kidding. Oh, God. Oh, wait, they... It's half time. Hang on, wait. Where are you in the league? Points. Uh, no, we're fl- mate, we're flying up the table. I'm telling you. What, like seventh, eighth? Yeah, you, you close, not need to fight actually. to focus on Brighton, right? You need to just Europa League spots with Graham Potter, right? That's all you need to think about. Do concern what, yourself with what they're doing. What, what, in what's Mersey the cup side? that Spurs are in? Like the international Europa League. Europa League. Europa League. Europa, oh, yeah. Yeah. Is it the Audi Cup? Uh, no, that no, no, was just Europa, the one that they won recently. Europa right? Cup. You know, with the massive. Anyway. Europa Conference. Europa yeah. Conference. What's that? And what even is it's that? The, it's the one that Spurs are in. Is it it's, like Intertoto? It's with like Stad Ren. Uh, what, is it the below the Europe? Yeah, there's one below. This is it? The, yeah, it's the, the third. Since when? Since this season. Jesus Christ. So it's the Intertoto Cup. What does that mean? No, that's a prestigious honour, actually. Uh, so <laughs> Do you remember it? That's the last thing my club has won. So really? <laughs> <laughs> yep. That's a major honour, that is. There's a picture of Scott Parker with it just holding oh. it. Oh. I don't know if you count the championship. He's not even, ball knowledge again, by the way, he's not even heard of the Intertoto Cup. Are you not? Wait, well, did you did you live under a rock when you were younger? Into Toto. It was Cup. huge. Really? Honestly, it was on like ITV2 or something. How do you Into Toto? T O T O. No, you're just gonna start so up a rock. Hot Toto under Cup. the collar. Can't wait to see you tonight. <laughs> oh, this is lies. It's lies. So, um, in terms of predictions, Reeve, mm. are these points from this week? Yeah, they're they're po- so we're level. We got three. Where? Well, we got technically, three if Arsenal points? win, we get four. Where's four out of ten. Top right, top right in red. So we got three out of ten. Four out of ten if Arsenal win. That's not bad. Yeah, James so got bad. five. Yeah, but he said draw for tonight, so he'll stay at five if Arsenal win. He's such goated on the knowledge. Let me it? see the fixtures. But a lot of these results came down to late finishes, didn't they? Like the the Villa game, for Oof. example. That was two nil in until like the last fifteen. Leicester. 4-2. Yeah, that's it. Leicester. That Mark Goldbridge clip, clip is class. Have you seen it watching along? Because it was like, it was 2-2 and then straight away from kickoff it was 3-2. By oh, the way... Going, Get in! We're back in the... Oh, fuck off! I love it. <laughs> so I love good. it. By the way, how good is that Jamie Vardy finish? The one to make it 3-2. I've not seen it. 
Uh, oh yeah, when half, he hit it like slightly. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's like, it. so the ball the ball's been spread out to the left hand side. Castagna's knocked it onto Perez, and Perez has dribbled it up to the corner flag and then like cut it back to Jamie Vardy. And the ball's like bouncing on the half volley, and he's like, yeah. s- as you would do, skimmed across it, sliced <laughs> it. And like finished it top bins like I, would I can't do. believe you've snuck that in there with a straight face. No, mate, Jamie Vardy. Oh god. No, How no, no. That? As in like, as in like, Jamie Vardy's intentionally yeah. mishit it, but he would mishit it. Right. Intentionally. I see. I no, see. no, unintentionally. Intentionally. Just, oh, okay. <laughs> you've been doing any more Tango Ice Blasts recently? I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> Shall no. we do predictions? <laughs> yeah, come on. Let me add a. Let okay. We got a Friday night kickoff, lads. Oh. It night is. Does, what, what does Gandhi reckon about them? I don't Friday think night, never, never, never spoke early. about them. Yeah, yeah fair enough. too early. Arsenal Villa. Yeah, it is Arsenal Villa. Arsenal. Ooh, ooh, at where? Emirates. Emirates. You got to. Against Martinez. Uh, Martinez. Martinez. Yeah, one, but Emmy. Emmy. A draw. A draw. I'm draw. going draw. I'm going back Arsenal. Emmy plays so incredibly well against us every game. That Oba is just, back, just, baby. Just Oba is back. Uber, Uber. Uber, <laughs> Uber. So you're both are going to draw. I'm going yep. Arsenal. Uh, early kickoff. Are you going to? No, no, no. I don't count because there's one before it. Yeah. Oh, Norwich, is that why? Right? So Chelsea yeah. are going to absolutely rifle Norwich. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Shock. Is it the early kickoff though. It is. So that's no Lukaku captain, even I'm, though I'm, they never will. I'm just keeping yeah. the arm. Sure. Bro. Uh, what? I'm keeping the armband on Salah for the rest of the year. What, <laughs> Salah versus United. He uh, he got twelve points. Play the fixtures. Fix- play the fixtures. And United are crap. They conceded okay, four to right. Leicester. Right, going Chelsea. Um, <laughs> Palace at home to Newcastle. Oh, I'm going. I'm are going. You? Yes, I am going. At, at the at the lovely ground it's a that is Sellers Park. It? It's a fucking den. It's just in the, it's just in the back of Somali and Croydon. Isn't oh it? yes, it is. Oh, it's, it's next to Sainsbury's. It's off the back. Yeah, of, yeah, 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 yeah. Sainsbury's. Yeah. Absolute shithole. I will go one-one again. I'll go draw. It's, really? It's the, it's, really? The, it's the Ted Lasso ground, isn't it? Yeah. Is the Ted Lasso ground? Yeah. They need, revamping. they need revamping the uh, the stadium. I can't it lie. Need, mate, it needs leveled. Drop a bomb on it. If we drop a bomb <laughs> on most of Croydon, it would be nicer. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie's from uh, Croydon. And you're not arguing, are you? <laughs> How oh, do you know about dude. Croydon, by the way? I've been there a couple of times. Shit. We, we did cycle for it, and it was pre. I go to Croydon all the time. All the time. All the time. <laughs> Croydon is the Middlesbrough of the South. It's fucking the hideous. Middlesbrough of the I South. I got a back all South. Hmm? Croydon's not far from me. I go for Croydon. I go for Croydon. Oh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Try <laughs> shit if I'm being honest. Uh, Everton. I know. No, sorry. 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 <laughs> Give me. I'm going. <laughs> I'm going. <laughs> Crystal Palace home win. Yeah. So Wee! Crystal Palace Newcastle. Patrick Vieira. I think draw. Yeah. I think nil nil. nil. It's always nil nil shit. shit. <laughs> One thing is guaranteed. It'll be last on match of the day. That's oh, absolutely yeah, nailed true. on. Actually, so wait, I'm penalty. just looking for... Yeah, it will be last match of the day. I'm just looking at the other games. Next on him? So the next game is Everton at Watford. Uh, Everton at home? Everton are at home. It's at Goodison Park, yes. They are prone to a stinker, you know. Not I, against Watford. I'm good. I'm good against say, Watford. They're so shit, but Everton are just such a... Do Corey against his old club. <sighs> I need Demar Gay. <laughs> Demar <laughs> Gay? <laughs> <laughs> this is... This is peak there, Baker, right I'm, now. I'm, yeah, I'm fading. <laughs> I've, I need Damari Gray I've just to... I've the mic. <laughs> I need Damari Gray to <laughs> score a breeze. <laughs> oh, shut up, will you, you might, You might even wildcard, though, so do you? Yeah, part of me wants the wild card, but also part of me thinks I've also made really good transfers over the last few weeks. So, it's so it... true. That's why you keep going down <laughs> from first. <laughs> Fuck you, man. I'm going Everton win. I'm going to go Watford win. Oh, That's yes. crazy! <laughs> do you know, what, do you know, what, do you know what's one. funny? Is this, is, this is the outrageous shit that the guests keep pulling and they keep winning week on week and we go, what are you doing? You know nothing about football. And then the result happens you know and then we look back at the thing and go, oh, oh. we lost again. <laughs> we lost again. But no, I'm going Everton. Yeah. I'm going to have to. Next up. Next, Next up is... Ooh, Leeds Wolves. <laughs> XG... XG against versus XG. I'm going for a little little cheeky draw. Really? Yeah. What what scoreline? Rafi- Rafinha's going to bag one. It's mm. going to be a one-one draw, mm. and I reckon Dendonka. Dendonka. Yeah. Bro, you, you're just pulling names out. <laughs> he just right? got, he played for Wolves once. He's a club hero of the Rooney's rampage. <laughs> <laughs> um, Wolves. Where is it? It's at Leeds. Ellen Road. They, they're gonna, smelling everywhere at the moment, mate. They, did you watch them against Southampton? Yes. Uh, did you? Yeah. Okay. Well, then you I know didn't. they are abysmal. 
going forwards at the moment. Leeds or Wolves? Uh, Leeds. Really? Yeah. Oh, they got Big Pat. <laughs> I'm gonna go Wolves. Back. Gonna go Big Rodri. I'll back you on Wolves. Wolves. Yeah, Wolves, please. I'll go out there, go for a draw. Yeah, one one, right? Yeah. Rodri- um Rafinha. Rafinha and Dendonka. You you say this every week. If imagine way. it comes in though, yeah, like, yeah. I would just look like a genius. So every every <laughs> every week we do the predictions mm-hmm. and we go we come around and we go, Oh, it's Leeds versus Fia goes. <laughs> Rafinha hat <actually. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Got him on my team. <laughs> I need him. <laughs> I need him. It's true. It's true. Um, next game: Southampton Burnley. Oh, that'll be fucking at, interesting. At St Mary's. Oh, that is honestly so dull. At St Mary's. Yeah. Che Adams brace is injured, isn't he? Okay, maybe not then. Adam James Ward Prowse free kick and a pen. Is he still banned? Okay. Well, Livermento assist. <laughs> 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 I don't know. He uh, is, isn't he? James Will Prowse got a three match ban for the straight red, didn't he? Oh, is it? Wait, who are they playing? Southampton? Was it straight red against? Um... Yeah, because it was it was a, it was a yellow, and then it was VAR, oh, and then it was a straight oh, red, wasn't it? Who are they against? Chelsea. Uh, yeah, Chelsea. No, as in this weekend. Oh, Burnley. Burnley. Oh, Burnley. 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 Uh, I'm gonna go Burnley. Oh, are you? Yeah. I'm Interesting. Gonna, I'm gonna go draw. Ball. I'm gonna go Southampton. What am I? Whoa! I hate Southampton. Point yeah, you club. really do. Point you, fucking yeah, club. Every they're si- just they're just the yeah. South Newcastle, just aren't they? Fuck, yeah, <laughs> same kit, different colours. Fuck off. Same kit, different colour. Nah, that's that's that makes perfect sense. Yeah, what can I say, lads? <laughs> oh, I love football. <laughs> okay, next game. This is a really interesting one. It's the wizard that is Graham Potter. Oh, one oh, of the Potters versus the fraud that is Pep Fraudiola. Who's at home? Uh, like it don't matter, bro. It it's, don't matter. It's at the Amex. It's Brighton it's, versus City. Oh, go, but go. They, yeah, it's, it's been a bit tight that Brighton once, uh, a couple of times. Uh, like Laporte next one, I swear. To was it? To, was it to win the, I'm gonna go City. Every part of me wants to say Brighton. But no, no, I, 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 I think if you're gonna back Brighton, then it would be a draw. Yeah. But if you don't back Brighton, then you'd have to say City. You no. Know? You uh, think Brighton are gonna win the game? Yep. Who, who the fuck is scoring? Don't say. More pie. <laughs> Cucurella. <laughs> Are you bringing him in there? Is that why? I'm bringing him in. Okay. <laughs> no, I think City are going to win. Yeah. Okay. Three cities. Uh, now we move to Sunday. So that was the evening game on the Saturday. Sunday's is Brentford Leicester. Could I just have the time of kickoff, please? Two o'clock. Oh, it's they're not both that early. They're not both that two. early. Mm. Two, uh, you know two. what? I'll go. Oh, Brentford are good, oh. but oh, go on, sorry. so are Leicester. I'll go Leicester away win. I will go draw. I'm going draw as well. Okay, this is going to have a very interesting point tally next week because we're all different. Well, I'm different. Mm. And when I have 15 <laughs> out of 10, <laughs> yeah, 15 out of 10, we know that he's fluked it. <laughs> all right, next game. The Hammers, Mighty Hammers versus Spurs. Ugh. Ooh. And it's at London Stadium. Oh, it's so a it's London West Derby. Hammer. It has to be high this, scoring, right? This, 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 yeah, this yeah, game yeah, last season so. was when Bale came back and everyone was like, shit, Bale's back. Is he still at Spurs? No, he's at Madrid. Oh, I didn't think... Yeah, I thought that he left. Mm. That really was the 3-3 the last minute, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Bang. With his corner. But yeah. He's back, baby. Well, he's not, he's in Spain. <laughs> he's not even playing for Madrid out there, is he? Playing Pro- golf. Probably not, yeah, probably playing golf. Um, I'm going to go for a West Ham win. Interesting. Mikel Antonio. You can't just pick <laughs> results based on the players that you have in your FPL. I can and I will. <laughs> okay. Because then when the game comes around, you lose twice. Because if your player plays badly and then the or, result is based off... See, that's what a pessimist would say. No, it's realist. If he scores, I win twice. Okay, fine. Michel Antonio, West Ham. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, I reckon they looked really good against us. I know we're shite, but in I'm going to go Spurs. But it's going to be like 4-3. Yeah, I I high scoring. I definitely high scoring. I'll make I it interesting. I'll go draw. Okay. Well, that's quite boring. There's no interest in about the Man. draw, really. Mm. High-scoring Mo- draw? Like Mo- moving like you're po- playing poker. N- yeah. What, picking a draw? A draw is the least likely thing to happen in football. No. Statistically, it is. Don't give me unless that. It's, unless it's like massively underdogged or really? something. Yeah. Game's a game, fella. All right. Oh. The big daddy. The big oh. daddy. It's 
Ollie's Red Men. Uh, I'm going to go nil-nil. Five-star nil. Reds. Well, United win this. I'm telling you now. Put your house on United Liverpool. winning this. Ollie is backed up against the wall. He needs a fucking result. He always pulls out his arse. I'm going to go United and convincingly United. Oh. Really? Against all... It's just... You know I what? Can what? feel against, it, bro. Against, I can feel it. Against me. this Liverpool yeah, side. Yeah, fucking bro. Man, fucking it's Ronaldo. They, they crumble at all. It's all Trafford. That. It's, it's Trafford. Ronaldo. They always... They always uh, yeah, they I could back that so hard, but I'm going to say a draw. I'm going Liverpool every day. Oh! Yeah. They're, they're so good this year. They're so good this year. You shag them then? So And if... if <laughs> so shag crack. the club. If, if, if they're still playing with McFred in midfield, they've got no chance. Fucking yes. hell, man. They got... Firmino, Salah, and Mane. Yeah. Ronaldo. That's all I'll say, mate. You can't use that every time. I can and I will. All right. Ronaldo versus Liverpool. Who wins? It's a draw. <laughs> <laughs> I said draw. Okay. I said draw. I suppose you said nil nil as well. Yeah. <laughs> but nil nil, then Ronaldo to bag one 93rd minute winner. It's a, <laughs> that's it's a one nil then. Yeah, shut up, man. <laughs> I go nil nil draw. Nil nil draw. Nil nil draw. Oh, that was quality. Um, uh, they're really good, though. That's why, yeah. What's really good? What's really good? The variance in our results yeah. is the most different that we've had across yeah. any. Week. One of us will look very smart. Brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. One of us will look very dumb. If it's you, I'll be, I'll be over it. Of course it, it will I'll be, be miserable. Of course it will be me. Yeah. Um, where's the pen? It's in my hand. Before Ooh. we sign it, Will, yep. this is the top we are giving away to the viewers yeah. uh, at the end of this year, maybe for Christmas, something like that. Yeah, something oh. like that. Uh, the reason why Ben and Chris are not on this, Ben signed the old England top, and this is the one Classic Football Shirts gave us, and Chris signed the old England top. So and Chris what, did where did the, what, where's the other one got? Up there. Right. So, so that's so just a Ben Foster signed the, shirt. The two most valuable signatures... Absolutely, you can't have. Yeah, yeah. no, but I'll get them. No, we, we, we'll get them. We'll track them down. Okay. I'm going to drive to the lakes and get Chris, and then I'm also going to drive to Watford and get Ben. Right, brilliant. Put him in the van. Perfect. Uh, <laughs> you ready? Yeah. We can, uh, ooh. Do I tighten it up? Where do you, what, where, what real estate do you want? A lot of good areas have been taken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's getting harder by it's the a toughie, by the episode. It's a toughie mate, to write on it as well. Oh, he's a, he's a pro. Look at oh, that. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, Mate, you've me, actually... Yeah. Look at that. That oh, actually God. might be... That I thought, might... thought that was Thogden for a second. <sighs> yeah, that, that might be t- challenging for best signature on the shirt. <laughs> Who's this got to be? Who's Alcott? Alcott. Oh, of course, of course it is. is. Yeah, of course it's Alcott, yeah. man. Well, that was fucking fantastic. Thank you very much for having us. Yeah. Um... Yeah, I was going to say. Thursday, yeah. Thursday 28 at 7 p.m. Please, boys. The, ki- the, the kickoff of the Copa de la Madre. And also get a pit side bucket hat coming soon. <laughs> It'll be unrivaled. <laughs> With that being said, follow us on Spotify, <laughs> Apple, oh, Apple Podcasts, and everywhere you watch podcasts. Check out everywhere you Atletico watch podcasts. Magorda. Thank you, you. You are butchering this outro. By no, the way. no, no. Let him, let him go. Then it's good. Get me out of here. Yes. And we'll see you soon. Goodbye, everyone.